Hello? Good evening, everybody. What's going on? We're here tonight. It's been a little bit. I've been busy. I've been playing uh, Baldur's Gate 3. I'm, okay. I've been busy, and I've been playing Baldur's Gate 3 for like at least three hours. Maybe four a day. Actually, I'll, I'll do the math in a second, because I'm kind of curious. I did the math when Elden Ring came out, and I was playing that game like, no exaggeration, I was playing that game like uh, it was a full-time job uh, for about the first week and a half that it came out. I think I did that for Zelda 2, maybe doubly so, because I also was sick when that game came out. See, happy Thursday, Wednesday, <laughs> it's Wednesday. Uh, hope y'all are doing well. I'm just here, uh, tonight, tonight we are gonna play Borrowed Trauma on Sophie Baby's channel, but she's not feeling well, so we're gonna, we're gonna do that another day, but if you didn't see the last, uh, if you didn't see the last stream of that, see if Sophie has the VOD up, because I feel, I hope it's, it's going to be like an ongoing thing now that the game is finally out. That we'll just be doing like a, like a consistent campaign, you know? Every time we played Borrowed Trauma, it's kind of just been like, we, we start new characters, we do missions, it's disconnected. That, that was early access. Now it's out. It's out of early access. We've been playing it for, I don't know when the first time we played it was. It may have been, oh god, oh no, it was over two years ago for sure. It may be like two and a half years we've been playing Borrowed Trauma, very off and on. Uh, but yeah, here. Here's a link to the first VOD. Probably gonna be playing next week or so. Once again, that's on Sophie Baby's channel. Uh, but yeah, tonight, since we're not doing that, I decided, uh, I'm just gonna, like, play some games I haven't been able to play because Baldur's Gate came out. Yeah, people, people, people have been posting and talking about Baldur's Gate. It's dying down. I don't even know if it's dying down a little bit because the game is long as fuck. Uh, we've been playing, uh, Bailey and Vegas and I have been playing for the past, like, week and a half, and we just got to act two out of four. There's four acts that it's split into fourths, um, which is a revolutionary idea. Uh, we, after 47 hours, we have made it to act two of four. Um, so yeah, it, it would probably be going a lot faster if it was single player. Maybe faster and like we would have, I would have beaten the game by now because you know, you don't have to wrangle two adults together for multiplayer, but God damn, th there's just a lot of fucking things to do in that game. By the way, hi mouse, hi coin, hi Nazi. It's fun. I recommend if you're, if you have, I mean, if you like the Disco Elysium, it's not like that, but it's isometric. It's it's isometric? Question mark. It might not be isometric. I isometric. I, in fact, I don't even really know what that means anymore. Very very high quality game. Very impossibly high quality game. And in some parts, and then like, at some points, it feels like Skyrim. It's so fucking glitchy. I've I've had crashes. I've had NPCs like. Let me, let me pull up the video that I took. Um, the other week on my first, like, start of the game. Yeah, con constantly there have been characters, like, T-posing and A-posing in cutscenes where they absolutely should not be. <laughs> Very recent, the, our last, uh, our last session we had, there was, like, a cutscene where demons were flying into a building and killing everybody and, like, shooting fireballs and shit. It just, like, they just didn't. The demon model didn't load on my end, so people were just dying, exploding. Like it's 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 an early access game, even though they took the label off. You know? How do I get a Twitter video on here? Is there a download button? No. Wait, it's on my computer. It might not be on my computer.
I'm just gonna put the tweet. I'm just gonna put the tweet link in chat, and you can click it if you want. You can watch the video if you want. <laughs> like it, it's just a uh, very good game, very funny game. Uh, you can do pretty much fucking anything. You can do anything, be anyone, climb anything, go anywhere. Um, oh, what the fuck? I forgot if you say you're live on Twitch. I forgot if you say pretty much anything on Twitter nowadays, like, people will name search it and people will like, I don't know if they're bots, but they will like your tweet. Um, bots are destroying me. I, like, sometimes I just want to ask about commissions. Sometimes I just want to ask, I, I want to say I'm live on Twitch to my followers and, and whoever they're, then whoever they decide to share it to. Uh, by the way, share my tweets and shit, but uh, I'm, it's not here for the hashtag Twitch juicers, you know, like hashtag go livers. You, all you out, all you bots out, all you, well, the lurkers in chat, I, I love you all the same, but the bots get out of here. Uh, Gamescom is happening. I'm not really sure what really there is to talk about with that. I don't even want to talk about that thing that happens because it's stupid and, and, and there's no point. Like, they, uh, I feel like there are a couple things. There are a couple things. That, uh, that Black Desert game, that Black Desert offline game actually looks insanely cool. I, I hope y'all have seen the trailer for that. Don't let the first minute or so, uh, deceive you. That trailer feels almost set up to get people to turn it off if they don't have, like, an attention span. <laughs> it starts off, like, the most... It starts off looking very generic. And and then, like, it slowly just is the most fucking insane fantasy game trailer I've seen in a while. I'm, I'm excited for that game. <laughs> Black, Black Desert Online. I don't even know what the appeal of that MMO is. Hi, Ranch Pudding. I don't know what the appeal... Of that MMO is. I don't know what the appeal of most MMOs are. Don't even get me started. Well, we can get started on Final Fantasy XIV, actually. Um, but I that game looks fucking crazy. And that may have been the only thing uh, noteworthy. I mean, that was yesterday. I, I haven't I haven't kept up. I haven't been on Reddit as much, and which which pains me. No, no, not even that. I haven't been on Reddit at all <laughs> recently uh, since the strike. I maybe checked that website once and then immediately was reminded like, oh yeah, this is why I don't check this website. Like, even on the civilized subreddits, it's just, I don't, it's, it's Reddit. But I kind of look back and I'm like, I feel so out of the loop now. Tumblr, Tumblr does not give me the news that I yearn for. Tumblr is good for funnies. Tumblr is good for art. Tumblr is not good for like... I don't know. I'm not, I'm not gonna find it. If the president, well, I was gonna say if the president gets assassinated, like I'm not gonna find out on Tumblr. But then that image of like Dean or whatever from Supernatural, like, like just was it showed up in my head, and I was like, oh no, it's going. It's gonna be like I love you, Joe Biden has been, etc. Like, okay, yeah, maybe I will learn there. Yeah, 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 Mouse Trinity. They'll tell me through Supernatural exactly. Yeah, th yeah, like Reddit. Reddit's good for that. R slash games was like my only place. I, I could still go to the subreddits, but I don't want to. But like R slash games, that's where I got all my gaming news. That's where I kept up to date. And Twitter, and and who, 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 Nibelon, dude, Nibelon, dude. It, it, it's like it's getting so much harder to access information conveniently now. The Nibelon resigning and retiring that was the that was the beginning of the end hope that dude's happy whatever he's doing but come on all right uh i am in if any friends are in chat i'm in my voice channel in my discord and i'm gonna start pseudo regalia i've heard a lot about this game i've heard a lot about this game and i've i've started it i've done the tutorial and then I was like, I gotta turn this off. I kind of want to stream this. And let me just tell you, chat. The words, I kind of want to stream this. Oh! 
are are a dangerous that's a dangerous sentence hi what's up maybe my favorite game in recent months that's high praise ow hold on don't play the music yet i want to hear it Um, maybe I'll just do this. Favorite game in recent months. I like this one already because I've heard it's short. I actually have to do something real quick. I, I did a... Did reinstall Windows recently. So I have to adjust all of my settings again, <laughs> which is cool. All right. Am I unmuted in my Discord? I'm not. Hello. Um. Okay. See, I've, I've spoiled myself on 30 seconds of the scan. Actually, more like 10 minutes. I played it on my Steam Deck. This game's aesthetic already. It's like uh, the environments of Mario 64 and like the character design of like, not design, the ca ca it looks like I'm playing Final Fantasy 7 in Mario 64, you know what I'm saying? I'm saying this all the time. Hi, Osk. That barely worked. I hope I'm not too late. Me when I'm playing uh, a big indie game two weeks after its release. Sorry, I didn't mean to fall out of my cage. I hope the princess won't be upset with me. Yeah, this game. I, uh, I don't really know too much about it, honestly. Uh, oh, shit. <laughs> Hold what? on, chat, is Matto loud? Hi, Matto. Am I loud? Oh my fucking god, you're loud. Yeah. Chat. Matto 424. Matto 424% volume. Nah, sounds normal. I don't even want you to talk. We can't, we can't, we can't. Okay, Bailey. Hi, Bailey. Bye, Bailey. We're not, we're not acknowledging that. We're not acknowledging that. We can't start today. Matto slightly too loud? Okay. I do have them at 140% volume. Oh, that's probably it. You're not usually that loud. I don't know. Chat, yell at me. Yell at me if Matto's still too loud. But thank you. Hi, I'm talking. Oh, let me stream Am I loud? Too. I might be loud. You sound, there's like a little bit of, there's a little bit of like room tone in the background of your mic that usually isn't there. Are you, oh. are you somewhere new? No, it's just fans. I can turn them off. Oh, no, no. It's it's fucking summer. I can't ask you to do that. It, like, I have to have fans going or else my AC, like, doesn't properly cool my, like, apartment. Mm. Yeah, don't don't turn off your fan. Turn, turn on crisp noise suppression if you have to, but... Don't tell Matter to boil. He's not a crawfish. Yeah. And we're not acknowledging that. Don't even think about it. Dream breaker. Press X button. Okay. Okay, that's how's awesome. that? You sound good. You sound good now. Sick. I I guess I had it off. I didn't know I had it off, but you know. Uh, I usually turn it off because it does make your audio quality generally worse if you don't have shit in the background. Mm. Yeah. I, this is like the tutorial enemy, but like, what incentive? 
do I have to get this guy? Murder. This, what if my choices matter? What if not everyone has to die? You know, Undertale did irreparable damage to everyone's brains back um, in... <laughs> yeah, well, yeah. I was gonna argue with you, but... As far as, like... As far as the, oh, I should murder, I should not, kind of thing. Undertale, Undertale was just the first game to directly accuse me, the player, of wrongdoings. And that's what changed me as a 15-year-old, you know? When a game accuses you of being a bad person... <laughs> Damn. Can, can you like blame five me? five games did it before that. <laughs> well, like, which ones? For me. Uh, fucking, let's see. Like, as far as just being, like, a generally bad person? Yeah. Uh, depends. How bad are we talking? I don't know. You said five games. Name them all. Uh, sure. Fallout New Vegas. No. Why not? Fucking, okay. No, because that... I, I mean, you, the player, as the human being sitting in the computer chair... No, like directly telling the player yeah. they're a piece of shit. Like the person, like the human being who's controlling the game character. What if this game starts uh, blaming me for shit? Earthbound. I believe it. I have chat. Chill the fuck out. I still haven't played Earthbound. Wow, what a shocker! You haven't played like a eighty to ninety hour no, RPG. No, but I've tried. I have. Yeah, like I've played it on my Wii U. It's it's a long game that kind of has like a slow start. <laughs> oh. Nano, if you want to disable that, sometimes the Discord just does not like high-pitched noises or voices or cat meows, which pisses me off. You can turn that off. There's like advanced voice activity or something in your voice settings. Turn that shit off every time. That shit's not real. To everyone in chat, turn that off in your Discord settings. Well, I've gotten to Tucson in Earthbound. Yeah. Someone said, like, this is a Metroidvania. One thing I do know is that this is a Metroidvania. So I should be trying things. I already have it off? Well. I don't know. Laughing is the most advanced voice activity. That's what I'm saying. No, okay. I had um RTX voice on for a bit, right? And it uh -huh. would always eat my laughs up past a point. Because I would just laugh really loudly. Yeah. That shit is not good. It's a pain in the ass, but sometimes you need it for when somebody's doing construction outside. I could slide. Or the summer, in general. I could tech. Bro, fucking, what is it? Uh, like, my dumbass has just been constantly like, Oh yeah, I should stream! And then like, every single time I go to like, press the live button, like, my new neighbor's fucking dog starts freaking out for, like, two hours. Oh. No. And I'm just like, well... I, I guess it's the dog's time. So I'm not it's gonna time. stop him. I don't know about that. I wouldn't go that far. Huh? Huh? What was up? There you go. Dog stream? Dude. Nah, if I was a, if I was a, still with my folks, maybe, but nah, I can't afford a dog. No, break <laughs> it to your neighbor's house, find the dog, and record it for seven hours. I, I just put a fucking security cam outside my door and dog myself. Yeah, be, be one of those neighbors that like points a camera like into their neighbor's yard. Ah, oh, hell yeah. Those people exist. I've seen them on Reddit months ago when I used that website. Your disguise is paper thin, but it'll fool most of them. What disguise? Not like it matters. It's like you're like the rest of us now. No eating past strong eyes. Disguise? Oh! Oh! I didn't notice these guys were little goats. Little fellas. That's cute. I thought they were just like orb heads. So, okay. This is a disguise. They're animals. Ambable. Um. No. Still need to uh, go back and actually play Mario 64 too. I feel like that one I do have to play. I mean, Mario 64 is still a solid game. The biggest issue with it's just the camera. Yeah. I I could just play that. It's not very long. No, not really. Especially if you don't go for 100%. I will not be doing that. Yeah. 
It's not like a bad 100% or anything, it's just that it adds like it's a guy. maybe four or five more hours to the game. Ah! Okay. I love. Ow! Oh shit. Uh, when I was watching, I was watching my friend play this the other day, and like, she dropped her sword and then went to another area and then just had to play the game without a sword. Like, if you lose that <laughs> shit, it does not respawn. It does not that's... respawn whatsoever. That's actually fucked. Okay, you got Hollow Knight healing. Ooh. Can you stop that shit? That kind of rules? I don't know if it does, because I don't know if that's even intentional. Like, you're supposed to have the sword. I don't think you can progress without it. Oh, I should have uh, dodged. I can dodge! Yeah, this music is fucking... This is the last thing I did on my first playthrough, and I did do it uh, first try, so I... The streamer's curse is already starting. Okay. Is there a lock-on camera? Oh, no, but there's a whole first-person camera. Is there not a lock? There is a lock-on camera. You can see target. It's emergent gameplay? Yeah, sure. Ow, okay. Be nice to me. Stop. This dude's like Margaret. You never realize Z-targeting your whole first playthrough? I'm telling you, just start pressing buttons. During any game at any point, just start pressing buttons on your controller and see what happens. I mean, that's what I do every time I start a game. I just Look, start oh. fucking mashing that shit like it's Mario Don't Party. Don't press that button. That button makes you throw your sword. Probably bop somebody in the head with it. That's yeah, cool. The keyframe animation is this is kind of yummy. Can you explain what that means? Cause I was just gonna say like I like that as low frame rate, but that's probably a more technical way of putting it. This is what people who don't read tutorials do all the time. I'm not a game grump. I read the tutorials most of the time, but also. Like, like, sometimes I want to do shit before the tutorial tells me. Yeah. Because sometimes the game will be, like, an hour later, and it'll be like, press A twice to double jump. It's like, wow. The fact that Coin didn't realize it was a thing, though, means the game probably just doesn't tell you. That's cool. I'm... Hey. Yeah. Ah! Yo, Will! Thank you for the raid! Won't you be my neighbor? Won't you be my neighbor? Won't you be my neighbor? Um... I mean, we probably were at some point. So yeah, What's up? You're gay. How was uh, how was my friendly neighborhood? Did you beat it? So you said you were wrapping that up today. That, that's another game that's actually on my uh, on my on my playlist. It's peak. Oh yeah. Oh. Yeah, I heard that was good. That's beautiful to hear. Did you see Arlo? Arlo is in that fucking game, isn't he? Yeah, no, Arlo's, like, a voice in the game. Wait, there's more? There's more what? Didn't the nuts and bolts know? What the no? <laughs> you, you... Stop. Wrong. <laughs> That's not... No. 
to, just because, just because it has neighbor in the name and Will's playing it doesn't mean it's a Hello Neighbor adjacent game. Yeah, no, it's like a Resident Evil game. You are typecasting Will and the concept of neighbors, honestly. What the fuck? Oh. It's like a Sesame Street Resident Evil parody. Yeah. No, I well, was, like, uh... competently made. Yeah, yeah, exactly. It's one of those... It, on its face... I, I've been following this game for maybe a year or maybe two now. Like, on, on its face now in 2023, if you look at it with zero critical thought whatsoever, it looks like... It looks like a bonbon. It looks like a... It looks like it, a... It, yeah. It looks like a... What, whatever. A, 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 I can only get a bonbon. Poppy? Yeah. I've seen multiple people see that and be like, oh, it looks like Poppy's Playhouse. Oh, it looks like Garden of Bonbon. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Simply. No, it doesn't. So yeah, sorry if just, someone in chat just said that, but... It's like the cursory, um... What is it? Uh... What's the word I'm looking for here? It's like the passing resemblance right. to the mascot horror shit that's been popular the past couple of years. And then people buy it, and then they play it, and they're like, Oh! This is just like Resident Evil. <laughs> literally just a resident evil deal straight up it is a resident evil fan game more than it is yeah. like anything else well it's like structured like a classic resident evil game all in but the fact that it's first person and it takes that from fucking seven and eight and then i gotta check it out of... yeah no yeah they give you a gun good. They give you at I'm least sorry. one gun. But, well, you, well, you said hello neighbor. You said hello neighbor, not my friendly neighborhood. Does hello neighbor give you a gun? Wait, it gives you... What the fuck? Yeah, sure, why not? Okay. That, that's one of the games, like, we are in... You can actually get a gun? You can actually get a gun. Like a gun gun? Or like a... No, it's not happening to me. I just saw you get a gun and I assumed what game they were talking about. These crystals are pretty nice, right? They make me feel safe. I think I'm gonna lick it. I bet it's full of minerals. Okay. I'm gonna smack it. And I'm gonna sit down. Oh, dude. Oh so yeah, you're gay. Oh yeah. Sorry, let me get the Discord menu out of the way. Thank y'all for the follows. Thank you, Togapaz and Hyperdynamo. You, it's a toy gun, but it's a gun. Okay, I know you get like a Nerf gun. You've never seen this game before? I mean, I guess that's not... It's not too surprising, it's not too big, but like... Everyone who's played this game... Which is only like three people I know... Uh... I'll start killing these fuckers now. Like, the game's not gonna... There's no judgment hall, there's no sands, there's no fucking... I'm not gonna feel guilt for killing these little egg shitheads. Right? No, this is, this is one of those PS1 style games, yeah. This one's kind of like PS1 in 64, because it really looks like a... It literally looks like Mario 64 in here. Indignation. Higher power gives you increased combat capabilities. Upon reaching level 2, the power of your, the range of your attack is extended. Level 3 damage increase. This is reset upon spending it on a heal. Wait, what? Oh, higher power. Okay, okay. So the more I hit... Yeah. Yeah, the more bar you've got, the the more damage you do. Ah! Oh, okay. Yeah, it really is a Bioshock type pop out, huh? But yeah, um, this I love games with this visual style. Chat, if you know any more games that look like PS1 games that are like full full games, like I like the aesthetics of the whole PS1 demo disc crew and and all that, but. I don't really feel like playing those, honestly. Maybe maybe, I, maybe I'll change my tune once I actually do, but... I mean, the demo discs are literally demo discs, right? Like, those, like, the idea is that majority of those will at least come out at some point, cool. right? Oh, or really? they're already out, I thought right? they were all... I thought it was just, like, a game jam thing. No, you're thinking of, um... I think Dread X is that. Maybe I'm, I'm like, merging the two in my head. But... Because, uh, yeah. Yeah, like, haunted demo disc games, oh. like, oh. The, it's like an actual demo disc kind of deal. Okay. 
So well, then and I'll then definitely not playing those because I'll just play the full games when the they come out. The full game when it comes yeah. out. Yeah. So let me know well, if anything, like, if any of those games have actually come to fruition and I can play them. A few of them have. Oh Jesus I, I Christ! Evil made. Then, um, <laughs> fuck. And then I know what is it? And then Dread X is like the short like horror game things, and that's about it. Okay. Okay. That's it. Oh, okay. Maybe I'll, uh... I don't know. Is there, like, a website that I can use to see which of those games are real? And uh, not not real, but have a, have a full usually. release? Okay. Yeah, either they're on Steam the or it's the usually. super boss that I found? C hey, can I have that back? Thank you. Jesus Christ. Oh, I know what you're talking about. I just forget the name of it. It's like the little dude with the big nose. We'll do I think. Nose. Yeah. What am I? What did I say? Something? No, mouse mentioned oh. something. Oh, okay. The thing that swung around. I know what you're talking about. Because I'm pretty sure I've seen a streamer play that. Or streamers. Yeah, like a little dude. He's got a big nose. There's like a button where he says boner. <laughs> Never mind. I don't know what the fuck that is. <laughs> Never heard sure of that before. There's a little button that makes him- Whoa! There's a little button that makes him say boner. <laughs> Me too, bro. It's called my mouth. <laughs> I don't know if that's a button. Um, not the way up. Uh, maybe not for you. Peeb! Yeah! Peeb! Okay. It's like Peeb's Big Adventure, Peeb's Adventures or something. It's interesting how it says speak, but then I said... The princess used to love having afternoon tea here. But the handmaiden run out of, a special, of her special ingredient. I guess the princess doesn't really want anyone else's tea. Okay. I definitely was confusing that with Dread X, because I thought PS1 demo disc games were supposed to be scary. No. Uh, the haunted demo disc and... Like, the Dread X is, like, supposed to be, like, horror stuff. Like, haunted demo disc, because it's a demo disc, tends to be a bit more varied, but it's usually, like horror themed or has some horror elements to it right okay. like uh i remember one year Please. i forget if it was last year or the year before right but um oh. there was like an n64 like style platformer that was just like this game is gothic sick, themed. The i love uh, oh I yeah love the no. mobility in this game already this game looks rad from what i've seen i recommend chat if you want to play this, I recommend. It's it's very cheap, by the way. This game is like six bucks, I think. I think it's, it's it is no more than eight. Five it's five bucks. Yeah. Oh, oh, I can hit those back. That's cool as shit. Can I hit these back? Yeah, it's five ninety nine. Yeah. So it's six bucks. A small price to pay for peak fiction, as SpongeBob and Patrick say. Yeah, know. bud. That's what they fucking say. Oh, ah, yeah! Oh. Chaos is right. Tori 3D is also another one that uh, got a full release. Yeah, I remember like Not watching... I think I was watching Scorpy play like Tori and uh, I almost said Pibby, Peeb. Uh, and I was just like, when is where are the, where are the jump scares? When is this going to get terrifying? But no, it, it's just like a platformer, isn't it? No, they're both just platformers and they kind of sometimes have a horror thing happen in the background. Okay. Like, I think Tori 3D has like a sequel, if I remember correctly. A jump and slide? No. Unless I'm getting things mixed up. Nope, there was Tori 2 that was released, to... uh, what is it? Like half a year later. What am I doing here? Is this livable? Can I live here? No! Did I walk into an area I'm not supposed to be in? This is a Metroidvania, so I would, uh, suppose so. Okay. What button am I missing? I can jump, I can hit, I can walk. They don't want me to just, like, slide off of here. Can I double jump? Did I forget a double jump ability? No, I'm just not getting... I'm just not, like, making it. Just not good at Mario. Get smacked. Hell, okay, I know. Well, goddamn, Tori's like a whole uh, franchise now, huh? Okay. Alright. 
them. Orbo's Odyssey. Oh, Orbo's Odyssey was peeb? Yeah, no, these are the same dudes. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's, I'm sorry. That's Orbo's peeb. Odyssey was peeb? Yeah. Orbo's Odyssey was peeb. You'll never get a guess what the what the other game we're playing today is. Orbo's Odyssey? It's fucking Orbo's Odyssey, yeah. Bro, you know for a fucking fact, I would have seen that shit, I would have gone, why are you playing peeb? I had literally no idea. Well, wait, wait, well, hold on. I, I, I want to see footage of peeb now. Because I feel uh, like I've seen it's Orbo's like Odyssey the, before. It's like, uh, what is it? Like, Orbo's in peeb, the game. I just, like, you don't play as Orbo in peeb, if that makes sense. Um. Huh, this is the same game? I don't know if they're the, exactly the same game, but it's the same characters for sure. Because, like, on oh, the Steam there's page. Orbo. Yeah, okay. Shit. On the Steam page for Orbo's Odyssey, Peeb's there. Well. Well, chat. There you go. There, there's some history behind our next game tonight that I did not know about at all. I've, I've seen Orbo's Odyssey on Twitter before. And that's the extent of my knowledge. I saw I saw Melody Burst playing it the other night when I was like, oh shit, this came out. That yeah. is uh, insane to know. I mean, hey, that's how it be. Yeah, not the same game, but the same characters in depth. Okay. There's another game that launched on demo disc. It was Mummy Sandbox, which is an ultimate ADHD. I'm just, hold on. Chat, hold on, because I got to look this shit up now. When I hear ADHD game, I got to check it out. Mum, mummy, mummy sandbox. It's a first-person digging simulator. Oh no, dude. Huh. Oh, this came out a while ago. Yeah, no, these like they tend to either come out like shortly after oh, or man. shortly before the demo disc, or it's like years down the line. No in between. I see. I see. No. Well, okay. I'm playing, okay, I'm playing this game, though. Ah, stop it, please. Okay. Crazy. There's only, like, three games. And yet... What else is, like... Whoa. Sans a key. S Sans? What's up? Evil Goat? C. Y. U. I. Wait. Seuice? Seuys. Seuys. Okay. Do I want to be here? Like, there's there's a whole other area down there. This is why I can't play Metroidvanias, because, like, I'll walk into a new area, and it's like... Well, I have to go back to the old area to see what I missed. And then I go to the old area, and then the old area leads me to another new area... And then I don't even have the like the item that I need to go to that area, so I have to go back to the first new area. I mean, yeah. This guy's here before. Oh. No, but that's how I end up making no progress in a Metroidvania. I mean, who makes progress in Metroidvanias? I want to beat right? this one. It's short. Uh... I mean, who makes actual progress in Metroidvanias, am I right? You've probably beaten one before! At least three! Well, that's probably more than me. I've beaten Hollow Knight. Um... That might be it. I'm trying to think of Metroidvanias I've beaten. Oh, oh Outer I... Wilds? Yeah. That's a Metroidvania of the mind. No, please, okay. Metroidvania of the mind? Yes. Chat, back me up here. What the fuck? It is. It is, right? You Please mean play it. Outer Wilds. Tell this fucking joker <laughs> on the call here. Look, I'll finish it someday. Yeah, what day? What day? What day? I don't know. I'm not giving a date. I was okay. going to stream today and I didn't. So fucking, Are you going to stream Outer Wilds? Not today. <laughs> then it wasn't today, was it? I didn't say I was gonna stream it today. I know. You, you sure did. You sure did, buddy. 
yeah, I mean, you could literally go back and see what I wrote last night in a sleep-deprived haze. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. T tell this Joker to play Outer Wilds. Oh. Look, one day I'll finish Outer Wilds and then probably play the DLC when I have money. You're gonna play it tomorrow? I'm not- I can't play it okay. tomorrow. I gotta do things tomorrow. Wilds. Yeah, exactly. Howdy. That's what I'm saying. Play Outer Wilds tomorrow. Anyway, bye. Okay. Bye. Oh, oh. Ask? Oh, I'm back here. Oh, I'm back here! It's- come on. Let me drink my water. What's that? <laughs> Who was that? So, I guess we've unlocked the shortcut back there. We could just keep going back there, but it's down here. Check daily walk. Okay, I saw, I saw, I saw that socks met a. Saw, I saw that socks met their kin. What? Is that oh. what's a daily walk? Alright, the- uh, yeah. Yeah. In? <laughs> long lost si- yeah, long lost sibling! That's what I'm saying, I don't want to fight this fucking maid again. She'll wipe the floor with me. In fact, I should not have gone this way again. This is a waste of my time. But I like that little flip symbol, dude. I feel like socks would- socks would strangle you if you compared them to a mammoth. No. It's just, it's just the fact that it's a mammoth. Sock loves mammoths. I mean, hey, Favorite, you're the expert animal. on mammoths. You know, yeah, if you're the expert on mammoths, you know that Socks love those, loves those things. No. Oh, secret room? Please! That's a real image? Yeah, that's a real image. I don't know where Osk would have found an image of somebody holding up, like, a oh. piece of paper in front of a map. <laughs> you can post the tweet, by the way, if you want, so people know what you're talking- what we're talking about. Yeah. With the real mammoth, real live mammoth. If I throw my sword in here, like... Can you say- yeah, I was gonna say, can you save? I'm gonna try seeing how I can, like, dispose of my sword, but... Whoa, whoa, hold on. Oh, you know you're gonna regret it if you fucking dude. lose the thing. This dude got sick flips. Yeah. Oh. You know, just fucking sick flip into your grave. This is cool. This game's good. I use the exact same angle as the image everyone uses to bother socks. <laughs> Wait, I didn't even. Uh, I need to. I need to see the tweet again with that in mind. That's perfect. Wow, I didn't realize like that's perfectly the mammoth that people use to bother socks. <laughs> Fuck off. Go away. <laughs> I'm going the wrong way. It. It is the mammoth. No, that's unmistakable. I'm- just kill me. Oh my god. Okay, I didn't mean it. Why'd they put the final boss here? Just, actually, no, just kill me. <laughs> It'll take me back to where I need to go. Not fuck that up this time. Why is that mammoth? Well, like, I was gonna say, why is that mammoth? Fuck, why did I do that? Why that mammoth is so like prolific, but guess how many mammoths are out there, really? <laughs> how many like real life mammoths can you go and see in the world? At least one. At least one. I bet at most five. What are these dudes spawning here for now? That's a lot of mammoths. Uh, uh, a 
That's probably less than a herd of mammoths. That's dude, that's sad to think about. I mean, yeah, warming. mammoths are dead. <laughs> that's all that's left. Glo global warming yeah. hit the mammoth population so hard. It stinks? Ew, is it still rotting? That's yucky. Okay, see, chat, you see what I literally just did? You see that thing that I described and then I did? <laughs> I went to the area, I didn't have the item, and now I'm back at the first area. It's, I wasn't kidding. This is how I play these games. Did I just fuck myself? It's very musty. Ew! That's fucking yucky. Are you shocked? Yeah! Like, what's in there? I mean, what, what's like so musty on that thing? It's, it's in like a fucking like room. Yeah, but they don't keep it like temperature controlled. And though, but it, like, why would it smell ever? Things smell. But like, why would this one smell? It's not alive. It's not a thing. Just because it's not alive anymore, it's still like... It may be intentional. <laughs> sure. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah, I bet they make a stink in there on purpose. Yeah, it wouldn't be the first time I've heard of that. It's actually a living mammoth. It's just been chilling there the whole time. It's migrating yeah. soon. Oh. Oh, it's one of those places. Metroid ga Metroidvania games... I'm sorry. The they're not very good. They don't have an arrow pointing in the direction of where to go. <laughs> yeah? No, yeah, none of them have had this, and I don't know why none of these fucking game devs have realized, like... Don't you realize that shit's confusing? Uh-huh. Hey, Gibson, are you looking forward to Star <laughs> The fuck? Absolutely not. <laughs> Oh, wait, uh, I mean, yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. It took you a fucking minute to understand I'm what so the hell is that. I'm playing it day one. Yeah, with that 100 and fucking 15 gigabytes. I mean, I downloaded Baldur's Gate. Yeah, but Baldur's Gate is, like, big, what? fun. Yeah. It's a cool game. People, people, what are you. Okay. You, do you know what you just said? You're, you, you, what? You just said Starfield is not big fun. What the fuck, what do you think, what, what do you mean? I'm not it gonna have fun with it. It might be small but... fun, uh, but like, I don't know if I'm gonna call it big fun. People will delude themselves into thinking it's big fun even if it's small fun, so. Don't, you know, you can't say that. Uh-huh. 40 Terra shits per mega farts? That's what I'm saying, Hubris. I did just get a new SSD, so I can't like, I'm fine. If, if I want Starfield, I, I really don't have any interest but in it. But it's on Game Pass. Oh, never mind. I don't have, I'm going to play it then if I don't have to pay for it. I keep it's forgetting. On, it's on Game Pass. Dude, Day I one. love Monopolies. Woo. Oh, yeah. No, I should have literally gone here because now I have the key. Like, <laughs> yeah, that, that, I hate. I, I, that's how I play these games. How long is this? Can I beat this game tonight? Oh. Hold on. I'll be right back. Give me a sec. Kind of have to pause. The beast. Oh man, I was wrong. Starfield is apparently a hundred and forty gigs. <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ, dude.
Oh god, that shit's the worst. Yeah. Fucking, what is it? Whenever games like default right. to the C drive, it just fucks me up every time. Welcome Chat, back. What gender is Sybil? Uh. What's this character's pronouns? And phone number. <laughs> phone number? Home address. Uh, okay. We fit the Metroidvania wall. Tower Unite put itself on your C drive? That's evil. She, her, I'm pretty sure. She's a bad motherfucker. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. at the very least, her. Okay. So, you ask Seth, like, this was a, an immersive experience with the mammoth. There's, like, ice on the wall and shit? What, what is going on over there? What do you mean there's ice on the wall? Maybe that, that's why it stinks. It's fucking humid in there. It's summer. It's, ice. it's summer. They took away all. They took away all my furniture, dude. No, they took away all his furniture. What the fuck, dude? Dude, they fucked it, my boy up. He had tables, chairs, wallpapers, a credenza. He has nothing. He had a rug. That's sad. You know, his grandma. His grandma gave him that rug. Well, fuck her, I guess. Who was they? Yeah. Who who was taking this guy's furniture? The fucking the repo men. Oh no! Not the Sorry, IRS. Little buddy. The IRS came. Uh oh. This looks. Uh, this looks like this hallway is about to judge me. I don't want to be here. Okay, but this? like. Oh. Is, is there like a big hallway that doesn't feel like it's judging you? Not San everyone but Sansa's. Whoa, dark orb. It's kind of the whole fucking point of Sansa's. Everyone thing. but Sansa's. Oh, yeah. There's too many doors. There's too many doors. It's giving me anxiety. What? What do I go? What, the, what? Where's the arrow telling me where to go first, second, third, and fourth? Where's the arrow telling me easy option and hard option? Uh, just fucking do it. This game's only accessibility option is to give the character pants. Yeah, and I'm not fucking checking that. Go, go somewhere else <laughs> if you want that. We're you not, want we're not the touching pants that. mode. Find another buy streamer. The, buy the game yourself. It's yeah. only five ninety nine. How pants are we talking? I am kind of curious, but no, we're not gonna find out. I mean, out. you could just flick it on and flick it off. No. No. We don't roll like that here. Uh huh. Do it? Do it? No. For $30, I'll put pants on Sybil. And also, <laughs> and I'll do that, and I'll buy Hi-Fi Rush. Hi-Fi Rush. I'll buy Cyberfunk, and we'll play that, too. That, okay, that's the price to give say, Sybil pants. I was gonna say, like, are you're fucking holding pants hostage for 30 bucks? Yeah. Because I, mean, I monetary don't... Gain, we're not, I guess, but... What the fuck? Why'd I put pants on her? This... It's not the developer's intention, chat. Look, man, I guess it makes sense. I was trying to buy pants earlier, and they Ow! were like 30, 40 bucks. And yeah. I was like, nah, fuck that. I'm gonna go to like, it's a fucking cheap clothing store tomorrow and hope for the best. Oh. It's like fucking, Whoa. dude. I'm gonna just take all the fucking money I just like got recently. Uh, I kind of need those pants ah, for an interview. I fucking knew it! I fucking knew it was going to be a dark nut moment. I fucking knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I actually scared the shit out of me. Damn, can't Put believe Put the pants it. on or I'm going to do something bad. You you are already going to do something bad. You know any threats you've made against me? You're going to kill me in like 50 different ways during TwitchCon. Speaking of chat, I got my TwitchCon ticket. If you're If you're going to be there, say hi. I don't threaten, I promise. Okay. Well, there you go. Just so you, okay. There you go, proving my point. 
Oh, item. Like how I can see that there's an item here because like the particle effect is going through the wall. That's that's cool. Yeah, you killed me already. Don't put me in a new layer of hell. What's this? Be cool. Double wall jump, please. Sunsetter. Press the left trigger key while in the air to plunge downwards, which can then chain into a high jump. Use the breakthrough fragile floors or simply to stop yourself in the air. Jumping right after the plunge will result in a high jump. I'm not, we're not putting on pants. The, the price for pants is set. I love that you're holding pants as an option. You can't shout out Eco Raptor. I don't care. I don't care. I'm not socks. If Eco Raptor finds out about my channel, good. That's gr that's great. You know how if, good if that Ego is. If Eco Raptor shows up, you just gotta fucking pull out that picture. You know how good that would be for me. Uh. Hydrate. Yeah, that's true. I'm getting worked up, and I'm not even hydrated. Fuck it, chat. Join us in following Eco Raptor. I don't care. Go do it. Wow. Water. Is this a new hallway? The light. Exactly. Pants cost $30 IRL, so it's, yeah, it's just it's just the price. It's just the price. Bro, I've learned that like I do not have nice looking pants for like interviews and shit. <laughs> Does this game have a fucking map at all? That shit costs money. Yeah, I'm I'm also doing job interview shit and they're like, you need business formal attire and it's like, oh fuck. I like one outfit that Or like that even business that. casual I don't even fucking have. I just have jeans and t shirts and like I think No, no, business casual is not jeans and t shirts. Did I go I went this way? No, jeans and t shirts are just casual. And then um Yeah. Business casual is like furniture. Khakis and a button up it's like i'm gonna look like my dad yeah but i need a job hey, okay and... go to the, go to the thrift store go to goodwill yeah i'm gonna go to go, like goodwill tomorrow or something because the fucking i went to like an actual clothing store and it was like yeah these are like 40 bucks minimum and i'm sitting here like i don't got that fucking money what do you mean khakis? What do you mean god khakis? What, what, he looks down? What the fuck? Do you, what do you got against khakis? What's wrong with you? Look, I grew up in a fucking at a Christian school where we were forced to wear khakis. I have a yeah. grudge against khakis. <laughs> That's fair. Also, I live in Texas. What does that mean? <laughs> uh, a lot of racist people wear khakis and polos, but uh, um, well, uh, that's hey. at least here. <laughs> If you saw me in khakis, though, you'd, you'd I mean, get like, it. I wouldn't give a shit. You'd get it. Like, All right, I'm, second I'm, like, chance? What do you mean second chance? Like, if I saw you in khakis, I'd be like, oh, khakis, right? Nah, I look but good it's in khakis. Like, you'd be impressed. <laughs> yeah, no, I'd, I'd be like, holy shit, that's Gibson in khakis. I, this game needs to give me a map. I'm already, like, looping. I've been- I've just been here. They took away no. all of his furniture. Luke they took the all- third. they took all his furniture away. <laughs> I need to- I need to talk to him again. They took away all my furniture. They took away all his what furniture. Fuck, that- chat, remember that for a raid phrase. I- I want you to remember <laughs> that right now when I'm at the end of the stream and I'm saying, Oh, what's the raid phrase? We didn't do anything funny today. Like, that's a raid phrase. Didn't you wear khakis to Fogo to Chow? Yes. Oh, yeah, the high jump. I almost- Okay, dickhead. <laughs> Did I miss? Dude, we gotta go to Fogo to Chow during TwitchCon. Have, have Ferris or Sox or anyone who's going, have they been? Like, I don't know. Uh, they're going to, though. Listen, it's like khakis are... To me, it's like jeans. I, I didn't even realize jeans were casual until recently. Because to me, jeans are... Uh, jeans look nice, like... Oh no, jeans look really nice, but it's just like th they're almost always associated with casual, unless you're like, what is it? Unless you're like an IT guy or something, right? Well, I guess that's why. What oh, no, the green like, orb? Because um, what is it? Collect all. Hey, you could, magical power. Okay. 
You can get away with wearing, like, jeans and a polo at an IT job, I think, right? But, like, what is it? I'm not making that. But in other places, it's like, oh, well, you gotta get the khakis on at the, at the very minimum. Come on, And that's, sibling. like, that's, like, grocery stores and shit. Like, if you're going for, like, an office job, then it's like, well, I gotta get them fucking suit pants. Or hope those khakis are, like... Yeah. Nice enough lame. looking that I can pass them as suit pants. That shit's so lame. It sucks so much, man. Please, God, let me fucking work remote for the rest of my life. I'm gonna I wish I could. My job. I wish I could, but I have no fucking education, man. Yeah, it's tough. Yeah. I mean, you don't, you, you don't even, you don't need an education to work remote. You don't need a formal education to work remote. You do definitely I mean, don't. Trust me. I mean, hey, if you. Can I know a lot of friends who do that shit. If you could hook me up with a fucking job, because nope. I've tried. <laughs> I, I would if I could, but I don't have one of those. <laughs> well, see, I have formal education and I don't have a job. Yeah. I, it kind of just is how jobs be. Yeah. Job market bad. Look, I'm going to have an exciting career, potentially, as a curbside attendant. Dog shit pay. <laughs> Hell yeah. Whoa! Uh, I keep finding the moves. Uh. Uh. Hey. You never know. You know what's the fucking funniest part? I got the call about, like, uh, an interview I gotta do later this week, right? Yeah. And it was like, hey, Dude. how do you feel about being a Kirby? And I'm like, the fuck what? do you mean Kirby? What do you mean Kirby? Like and it's like. And, like, and it took me, like, a second to process that they meant, like, oh, this was the fucking H-E-B job I applied for that was, like, the curbside attendant shit, right? Oh. Like, putting groceries in people's cars. But they call them Kirby's. And I'm just sitting here, like, thinking for myself, of, like, a Kirby? For the army and of Kirby's then, that they're And then it's like, oh, yeah, 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 I'm still interested in the job. And then, you know, they ask questions, because, of course, they do. And then the final one is, what do you think makes a good Kirby? And I'm just sitting there, like, Pink, what the fuck uh, do you mean? Flying, uh... Oh, Pink, God. flying, can transform, depending on what he eats. Can never die, ever? Never dies. Wow. I don't feel like, what the fuck do you even say to what makes a good Kirby anyway? Some Ocarina of Time ass shit. Yeah, honestly. The oh, torch is more area. than anything, honestly. No more! No more areas! I need to clear out one! I need items and trinkets and baubles. <laughs> Riches and baubles. That's a car hop. Oh, car hops are like, have you ever been to a Sonic? Nah, no, yes. Uh, the people who bring you your food. Oh. That's Sonic. Oh. That's a car hop. Okay. Oh, face. What are you gonna do to me? It used to be, like, a, actually, like, a very common thing in, like, fast food, and then they, uh, what is it? And then, like, they stopped really doing the, like, curbside uh, car hop shit until the pandemic hit. And then yeah. everyone was like, well, fuck, we gotta do that again. <laughs> So now every fast food place has like a, what is it, an order online deal. Can this thing die? No? Okay. That's an invaluable service. I don't know what I would do. Ow, without curbside delivery. Oh, it's great. Uh, what is it? It's like... I don't know, it's just like, I've never really had too much of a problem going in the restaurants, right? But like, something about it just is like, I don't know, I just feel anxious in fucking, I guess in public in general, which is uh, great. Yeah. So I have to be in public. That's normal. Yeah. At this point, I'm like, whatever's the fastest and has the least amount of human inter interaction, that's how I'll pick oh, up Oh yeah, food. same, every time. Oh, fucking, how can I cut out the middleman as much as possible to the point where there's just no middleman? Is this a puzzle? Is there something here? Put your sword in the hole for a for a prize. Dude, I'd laugh my ass off if you got it in there and then it just, it just like didn't give, it, you, yeah, it didn't give you it back. 
Oh god, where's my supplement? It's on the other end of the room. Well. You gonna go you gonna go get it? Yeah, I have to. Alright, I'll be right back. <clears throat> okay. Also, hi. Hi, hi. Why'd you shout out Eager Raptor? Yo, shout outs to Ego Raptor. No. <laughs> and by the way. Oh my god. Whoa. That's spoilers, bro. I haven't watched that far yet. Hi, Lawrence. And also, hi, Ellie. Don't- I don't want any more of these fuckers jumping out at me. Well, Empty Bailey? Yo, that's my friend. I don't know if they're empty, but that's my friend. That's me when I have to empty all the blood out of Bailey's body. Yeah? What? We've all been there. This so is the daily pants? Occurrence. With the, the, I, the, there's, a, there's a price for the pants. It's not free. I but feel you, like you expect me to put on these pants for free. I feel like at some point oh. you're gonna concede, and it's gonna be at Why the would stupidest I concede? time. Because I don't know. Okay, <laughs> shout out, bro, Jared. How do I unshout out? <laughs> How do you? I, I, wait, I, I, I didn't. They actually do get a notification when you shout them out. They literally do oh, get a notification no. when you shout them out. Because I, I had a notification in my fucking. Uh, notification feed that I got a shout out from Socks, and that's when I shouted myself out in, Sox in Socks' channel. Like, they get a notification. They get a they notification. Get a notification. And, you, and you know this. Yeah, you literally know this. You fuck. The thing is, it's like, it fucking Ego Raptor is like not active really. It's like on Twitch, right? Ego Raptor, I wouldn't mind if he like retweeted my stream announcement post. Bro, <laughs> Bro Jared, Jared, oh my fucking god, I would like never go live again. The most terrifying thing is just like chilling in someone's chat and then Dude, just seeing on, shut a up. pro Jared emote. Hmm? This song fucks. We can't talk about pro Jared while the song's playing. <laughs> We're just moving away from it. Dude, now we can move back to it, but I want to hear this. This song cheats? What the fuck does that mean? No, no, it doesn't. You hear that chord? What are you talking about? It cheats. Oh. Oh. Alright. So anyway, Pro Jerry. So anyways. What? What, what do you want to say? The most horrifying shit is vibing in like a chat oh. or like watching someone stream, right? And then just seeing somebody pull out a random Pro Jared emote. What? It's, what do you mean like, I, Pro Jared has emotes? Chat, if you have a Pro Jared pro emote, Jared put them is in my like chat right now. Pro Jared is like an active Twitch streamer. If you, have a, if you have a Pro Jared emote, any Pro Jared emotes in chat, put them in my chat. Put them in the chat right now. <laughs> It, it's just like all of his emotes are just like. I mean, what what do you expect from pro Jared emotes? I guess, but like, ugh. Thank God, no. I would have had to ban some users today. <laughs> don't give me a, don't <laughs> give any so... don't give money to pro Jared. Give me a sub to Ego Raptor. That's you can. Oh. You can give me a sub to Ego Raptor, and then I won't use his emotes. Yeah, fucking apparent like Pro Jared streamed two days ago. <laughs> oh my god. He's like an active Twitch streamer. What's that? There's like items on the ground that I can't like touch. Chat, is this a glitch? Do I need like, do I, does Sybil have to unlock the ability to read? No, it's not a glitch. Okay, because there's been a couple of them so far. Sybil can't fucking read. 
glitch? Like, Pibby, you are sick in the head. You have a Pibby, you have a Pibby glitch in your frontal lobe. I don't know what to tell you. Pibby, Pibby in your brain, like a fucking, uh, tadpole. Yeah, You're a true Pibby here. What? Okay. I'm sorry. Sorry, sorry to bring that up. I forgot, I forgot about that incident. I forgot about the Fredbear incident. Yo, was that the point of 83? I'm scared. This went from awesome to scary. What the fuck? We're like in a brain. Maybe Sybil Illiterate? I think Sybil Illiterate. And I like that. I like those two words next to each other. Sybil Illiterate. Sybil Obliterate. Uh, hold on. We're, we're getting somewhere here. No? Okay. Can't do anything in here. Oh, but I can jump high. <laughs> Will that help me anywhere? Okay. Well. This is like this be, uh, this is scary. This is like meat world. Meat Town, USA. This world is a frontal lobe. Ah! Scared by my own jumps. This game has an insane amount of ability, uh, mobility for like a PS1 style platformer. What's an indie game without Meat World? That's true. Meat Boy did it. So everyone I mean, else Meat Boy kind of had to do it. Why? It's Meat Boy. Well. He was a boy of meat. Yeah. It, it, I don't even know, like... Does, why is there... I don't... Ornstein and Smo? No, they're gonna... Oh, no. I haven't even... I haven't played Dark Souls yet, guys. I don't like this. There's a, there's a big guy and a little guy. Yeah. Oh, Ornstein. I fucking knew it. Dude. Ah! He's too tiny. This is a fucking troll level. your ass, but he's tiny. Jesus. Okay. Am I doing this right, chat? Is this like the intended path for this game? I feel like I'm seeing no. like all these scary ass worlds. Maybe that's just what a Metroidvania is like. I, I'm pretty sure that's just what a metroidvania is like. I'm used to linearity. There isn't much an intended path. Okay, if you say so. Yeah, I've only seen like oh. snippets of this from like other people's streams or like videos or whatnot, so right? Is this and yeah, like I haven't seen like connecting areas basically. So all I know is like, oh, here's a room, here's a room, and that's about it, really. I see. So, uh, yeah, you're flying blind, Chief, and I'm basically right there with you. I miss when Metroidvanias had maps. I tried to play that, uh, the, the last Metroid, well, not the last Metroidvania, one of the last Metroidvanias I unsuccessfully tried to play was fucking, uh, Carrion. And let me tell you, that game was pretty cool. I maybe could have finished that, because that was, like, a cool, like, horror, like, you, you are the monster type Metroidvania. Like, very, very cool. But there was no fucking map in that entire game, and it was not as short as this. And that, and hearing that instantly turned me off. It instantly made me uninstall the game because I don't have the fucking time to be remembering like which rooms I've been in in a Metroidvania. That's 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 where I draw the line. <laughs> I'm expecting this game to have no map because it seems like it won't, but this one's small. I could I could eat this game in one bite. Yeah, no, this game's like a couple hours. I mean, I, I guess every game's a couple hours, do? but you know what I mean. What did that? Wait, what? What did that just do? Did I fuck up? Did I fuck up? Look, you'll feel smart in oh. about three hours when you figure it out. 
Well, that's how they get you. You get lost, and then uh, you feel smart in three hours when you figure it out. that no okay all right i'm just I, i'm doing things and they're happening ah you have to die now oh i have i didn't even realize i had a key in my inventory so i i guess we can do something with that I don't know, do, do doors in Flesh World have holes, have keyholes? I still can't use whatever these things are. Okay. Background noise of the fan gets too loud. Uh, find a different streamer. It's summer. <laughs> find it's a streamer summer. in the European Union. Uh, th that's not going to change much. <laughs> uh, find a find a streamer on the other hemisphere of the planet. You mean Australia? Sure. <laughs> Have I got? Okay. Some sort of map would be nice. Or just tell me. Give me like Heroes Path mode. Tell me where I've been. Show me where I've died. Not even die. I just want to see like a line on the floor where I've walked before. I think all Bro, games fucking, should have this. Hero's Path is the funniest shit because fucking what is it? I remember like getting it right in Tears of the Kingdom or whatever, right? Secret. And fucking like instantly realizing I died like forty fucking times within uh -huh. the span of like a minute. <laughs> And it just, like, kept having Link scream for, like, a minute. I'm just sitting here like, Jesus. I missed that game. Yeah, Any, I wish I could finish Tears it. Anyone remember Tears of the Kingdom? Why can't you finish it? Uh, brain worms. Oh. Uh, see? Yeah, game's fun. Game's good. Why don't you just, just can't finish, finish it? it. Can, you not, like, can you not bring yourself to beat the final boss? No, it, okay. It's gonna sound stupid, right? But... I can't, like, I don't know, just something, like, I've tried playing it a couple of times, and my brain just can't latch onto it anymore. What do you mean? Like, I, I play it, and then I'm like, well, I don't want to keep playing this. You can just, like, go, go and beat the game. It takes, like, you know, a half hour. I mean, I'm at the end of the game. I just don't want to finish it. Dude. But not because I'm like, oh, I want to, like, oh, I want to savor the adv No, it's like, I'm sitting here like, oh... I, I just don't want to finish it. Dude. I don't know. It's stupid. And then Come there's on. like... And then part of it is like... You want to Part of it... I kind of do, but I kind of don't. You know? You can't not finish Outer Wilds and Tears of the Kingdom. Uh, what? I'll have the, you the know longer, that The I... longer it takes you to not finish King Tears of the Kingdom, the harder it's going to be to finish it. I'll tell you that right now. I guess. If you don't finish it today, there's a less of a likelihood that you're gonna finish it tomorrow, and so on and so on. But the likelihood of me finishing it today was like negative two. That's not all you have to do is open your Switch and like play the game for 30 minutes. <laughs> that sounds so much easier on paper, but like. I'm you. Hey, I I'm played that game like eight you. hours a day. So. Yeah, and I did too. Well. <laughs> Whoa. And you can finish it. It's too, I got it's too emotional. All I get it. four it's dungeons. Emotional. I got. I, I did all four fucking dungeons Where in the going? goddamn lobster shirt. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm a fucking. I, I did my time. You didn't, cause you haven't seen the credits. I do. I need to see the credits to know I like the game, but I'm don't so want to finish it. 
Have do you have you seen the ending? I mean, I kind of vaguely know. Have you what seen the ending? It. No. You are fucking missing out. Come on now, chat. Tell this guy. Tell this guy why they're wrong. I mean, it's just like that's that's like that, that's a good ending for a Zelda game. Yeah. I was I was satisfied. I'm gonna leave this area now. I think I've done everything I can here. I mean, like, part of the reason why I don't want to go back is also just, like, I was, like, kind of, like, what is it? My brain was like, oh, the fuck do they mean about, like, this, this, and this story-wise, right? Like, I'm not saying it's, like, a bad story or something. It is, and it the is. performance, it, it is. Okay, yeah. It is. So. Oh, God. Glad we're on the same page, then. I'm broken. Get me out of here. I, I thought I would have to actually dig myself out of that hole for no, a second there. Heck? It's a bad story. Good. Thank you. Okay. It's, it's, a, it's a it's a Breath of the Wild game. You know, okay. I'm, I'm glad. It's so bad that, like, everyone... Like, I haven't checked the general... What people think about that game's story in a few months. I think everyone is, like, wrong. Everyone was thinking, like... Everyone was theorizing on Zelda, which first of all, that's a mistake. You can't don't theorize on Zelda plot lines and, and, yeah. and timelines. That's how you get the Zelda timeline, and that's not. Oh, no one can wants I that again. can I talk about something stupid that like I hate a lot? That they're like, oh, but it's canon though because it's in the Hyrule Historia or whatever, right? They made fucking up. like fucking post like 2010s, 2020s, like. Hey, oh, fuck. this is actually what happened in Majora's Mask, okay. and it pisses me the fuck off. Yeah. Because in Hyrule... Like ambiguity. In one of the Hyrule Historias, or like, whatever the fuck, right? One of the Zelda things, it's like an official book, but it's like, oh, well, all of these are like, theories by the people that made it, right? Or whatever, so it's yeah. not exactly canon or whatever. Who the fuck cares, right? But... One of the things that pisses me off is like they were like, "Oh, by the way, Majora's Mask, yeah, it was all a dream." They did not say that. They did not. That's, it, that's it was insane. A, it's a fucking dream world by Skull Kid and Majora's Mask colliding together, and Link got sucked into it. Oh my god! And everyone else stopped existing the moment Link and Skull Kid left the, the realm. They already did that. It's like Awakening. It's it's so fucking. I already bad, don't like though. Link's Awakening because of that. It, it's like. Like, ah! at least with Link's Awakening, they fucking, like... But I've been here. <laughs> they had that happen in the fucking, like... What Where's is it? Go? In the game, originally, right? Yeah. And they were like... And they tell you that before the game ends, too. They're like, by the way, this is all a dream. Duh. It's happening. I'm telling you this right now, like, near the end of the game. But it's not the end of the game yet, right? Okay. I still didn't like it. I don't know why. People... people yeah, I've enough. read essays on why it's good. I don't like that. Yeah, I mean, it's a good game. It's a good game. Like, I, you can you can not like the story of a Zelda game. That's not like an don't. un... Yeah. I mean, it's... I don't know. The Oracle but games, Oracle though? Games are good. I may check those out, but those seem, um... Well, maybe... Maybe it's just the way Rudd plays them, but they seem pretty grindy. Oh, they can be a little rough sometimes, but... You know. I played through seasons recently i haven't touched ages yet i want to play through ages i just haven't touched it yet right yeah and seasons was good like but man sometimes that game could be a little rough yeah. and then oh if you're trying to get all the fucking rings god help you right red did get all the rings i think oh god i know where am i going where am i going i'm, I'm like adhding myself back to the start of the game like that Oracle, the Oracle games, um, what's the word? The Oracle okay, games are, that. Okay. the Oracle games are weird, yeah. right? In the sense that like, they, the way they're intended to play is you pick one of the two, right? And that's your start. And then you go to the next one once you beat the first one, right? And then the third and game then, then canceled. Well, actually, no. And then you play the game you didn't start with again, but this time with a code to make it like it's the original version of it, right? What? Uh, because the story changes when you, like, play the second game, right? It changes slightly. Like, some stuff's added to it, and things are, like, connected to the previous game you played, right? I'm explaining it poorly, right? Um, so, then there's, like, they give you a code to basically play 
the second game you play. Go. Where's the Where's the key with the door? Chat, <laughs> you're you're light. You're no. back sitting a little loud, actually. Back sitting a little loud, if you know what to do. Yeah. Like I'm, I'm bad at Metroidvanias, chat. Yeah, if you play the second game, it adds a true ending. It doesn't. Was it, uh, shit, right? Was it Kate talking to us about? No. You may not have been there. About Fire Emblem Fates recently. I feel the, like the insanity I, of like that conversation in that game was like so much to me that I, I like. I feel like I remember there. talking about like the baby dimension at some point in time. Yeah, the baby dimension, like, yeah. Yeah. That, ch chat. Any Fire Emblem heads in chat? I get you. Well, I'm gonna say that I get you, but like, what the fuck were they? What, what they were all smoking something. Actually, yeah. like when they're they were actually on something when they're making that game. Their face is fucking weird, man. I'm busy doing my UVs. What do you mean? I mean, um, can I do we need me to describe the baby dimension? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Okay, so uh, let's go back in context, right? Yeah, go back to Awakening. Fire and em Fire Emblem Awakening is a game about time travel, all right. And one of the gimmicks of it is that Prom's uh, what is it? Krom's kid Lucina comes back from the future to, like, help save the day, right? Um, and then anybody who gets, like, into, like, an S rank, which is like, Oh, I'm gonna fucking marry you as soon as the war is done, right? Like, relationship with someone else, right? Uh, their kid shows up as, like, a character you can recruit, because they also came back from the future, right? And so, like, the second half of the game is recruiting, like all the kid units basically and like and then doing the story oh along god. it with it oh my right? god we're back here they took all of his furniture away they took all of his furniture they away took away all his furniture and then um what is it well that's so shitty key. the kid units were like a popular thing with awakening all right and so they were like well we're gonna do it again and so they made fire emblem fates they sure did um and uh -huh. One of the many things that's confusing about Fire Emblem Fates is, um... Pocket dimensions exist. And, like, your main hub camp area is in a pocket dimension, right? But also, like, you know, they still have the s rank romance stuff, right? But now they're gonna have- they have the baby during the war, right? <laughs> so you- so what they do... <laughs> is that they put their baby into a pocket Fuck dimension me. for them to grow up while they're busy fighting a war. <laughs> and then you recruit the, the newly adult kids who had grown up without their parents for like 18 to 25 years, uh -huh. right? And it's like, by the way, fucker, we're here to get you. We're going to war. <laughs> this is the baby dimension. That's also the game where you can, uh... Fuck all of your siblings. Oh god, the incest. Oh you can, no. You can, you can either... The, the way that that game, like... Like, has the... The way that that game is like a three-game thing, and like, no matter which one you You're play, fucked. no matter which You're one you play, fucked. you are fucking your siblings, like... It's so fucking funny, because it's like, okay... There's Birthright, Conquest, and what is it? Revelations or some bullshit, right? And then, fucking, like... For birthright, it's like you're with your blood family, air yeah. quotes, right? And so, which makes it even worse. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I, I think the, they're both bad, The honestly. Metroidvania sickness is starting to kick in. It always, like, I don't know how I managed to play these games and only run around in circles after the first hour, but, like, it, it's, it's like, it's set again. No matter how Look. small the fucking game is. I couldn't beat Axiom Verge because of this. Bro, fucking... The amount of times I have to look at guides in Metroidvanias because I'm like, all right, I'm stumped, and then it's like a room right next to me that I've walked oh, past five place. times. This place, yeah. Where's the mini map? Great. Just give me a mini map is all I'm asking for. But yeah, fucking. Um, yeah. What is it? So birthright, right? It's like it's your blood family, but you can still romance them, <laughs> and then once you fully romance one of them, they go. Oh, by the way, actually, um, your mom was our stepmom, so we're not blood related technically. It's like who hasn't been there? 
It's like, okay. <laughs> it's like, and, and so, book. And then, Civil can read. Quest. You read a book on musical theory. Yeah, I've done that. Ooh. The ramblings of a madman. That's what I'm fucking <laughs> saying. That's what I've been fucking saying. Anymore. I like. Ooh. Read a book about how to deal with loss. Your mind is mended whole, driving you sane. Oh, there you ah, go. Okay. Thank okay, good for you. But yeah, fucking, what is it? So, that's Birthright's weird bullshit, right? You read a book about a little thimble that goes on a big adventure. You hope he has a good time. But I read the book, I should know. Erm, um, developers? No, the future adventures. What's the whole book? Oh. You read a book about a girl who gets whisked away to a fantastical world without strife. She seems happy. Yeah, it's for yeah. <laughs> um, so fucking no, conquest, dude. right? Yeah. Conquest is um, you decide to stay with your adoptive family, right, and, and go to war, just fuck it, right? Um, and your adoptive family is just like totally like, oh yeah, by the way, I'm glad we're not blood related because like, I've loved you since day one. And you're just sitting there like, did you just say that? Dude. Please? Why did you say that? Imagine like it being 15 and like, you, you, you just want like a fun action game. It's like, just like, oh yeah, I'm gonna team up with my sister and we're gonna have fun fighting it, the I'm enemy. So what do you mean? I'm so glad I did not finish Fire Emblem Awakening. I gotta, I gotta be honest, if this was, if this is what came next, I, I'm it, glad it, I didn't finish the previous uh, one. And then, oh, um, double jump! We'll do an air kick, hitting walls and object with it will cause you to jump away. Can be done for three times. Yes. What's so scary? What's so scary, Nano? That shit's scary. Bro, fucking. What is it? Are scary. I think the worst one is the reveal and revelations because the game for Birthright and Conquest has been pushing you to marry this one lady if you're like a dude, right? And and like has just constantly been like, by the way, this is like the canon, like this is the one you should be romancing, blah 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 blah. Very you know, cool. like very important plot character, yada yada, right? That's a cool wall jump. And then in Revelations, it, one of the big reveals is that she's your cousin. <laughs> and That's she's the insane. only actually fully blood-related character. Oh. Like, <laughs> it's... I, I need you to know, Chad, if you're not a Fire Emblem fan, I, I can assure you, even as one, uh, even as someone who's not, they're not all like this. She also knows this. I think she tells you, yeah. <laughs> they're not all like this. Like, for this one game, they were really... Really it's so bad, man. They were off it. I don't like, know. They, they've done this shit in the past with like some weird incest shit, but then it's like this is like them at full fucking throttle. Like it's a Nintendo this is uncomfortable. Game. Yeah. Oh, I like this. That this is cute. Cute way to show me where to jump. Dude. Yeah, I also fell off after after Awakening. I never finished it, and I'm glad for that now. And, Seems and like it got just, better again after that. Like people, it got better after that. But it was like, holy shit, <laughs> that was a period. Yeah. I, I just all I remember of Fates is the weird okay. incest shit, the baby dimension, and then there was a guy who's just basically Superman. That what? Yeah, there's just a guy whose whole gimmick is that he's like themed around comic book heroes. He's sure. just like a he's just like a Mr. Incredible looking motherfucker running around in Fire Emblem Land. Oh god. That's oh, all god. I remember. This is like a puzzle game, like oh. I mean there's probably more, but it's just like yeah. Okay. Yeah, he's just all might. That's the, the yeah. He's just all might. That's great. Yeah. Oh. Which is like I think this was before this was even that was a thing, which is the funny part. Check this section out. This is cool. Also, the, this cool. the other, oh, the other thing of note with the fucking revelation is, um, so birthright and conquest were sold sold separately, ah, right? Yeah. So you had to buy the other fucking version to like, you know, play them, right? Ah. Um, revelation was also sold separately, even though it was technically the true path and the fine, like the finale kind of deal, right? Uh. But it was never sold physically. <laughs> 
Yeah, I remember that. That was a digital only experience. It was a digital only experience. So, uh, all you Fire Emblem Fates fans who just didn't touch Please. Revelation for some reason, uh, I'm sorry to say that that's not available Wait, yeah, you anymore. Can't play it anymore. It's okay, I, I heard they're porting it to Switch. Because it's the best game. It's a good, because it's good. Mm. And people want it on Switch. But oh the, the change.org petitions are going off. I heard they're almost at 10 signers. Yo! I want to talk to the people who consider that, like, they've played all the Fire Emblem games, that's the best. Like... They're out there. Oh my fucking chicken coop. It's just kind of a bland Fire Emblem, too, when it comes to gameplay. Uh, the only decent one is Conquest, if I remember correctly. Damn. Yeah. It, it's like... Hello, guys. Um... Nice. It's like Birthright's like stupid easy. Oh wait, I remember one other stupid thing about Birthright specifically, right? Yeah. I, I don't think anybody gives a shit about spoilers for No, if fates. you do, uh, yeah, find a different streamer. I mean, we just talked like 10 minutes about <laughs> fucking like the go weird watch incest XQC, shit. Like go to the bathroom while he's watching someone else's content. Fucking, so there's like a ninja character, right? with, like, green hair, who follows you on every route, because he's like, yo, you're, like, my best friend. I fucking love you. You're the best, oh, yeah. right? Like, it, it... I think you save his life or something, so he's, like, super in debt to you or whatever the fuck, so he's like, yeah, I'll follow you no matter where you go, right? And so in Birthright, um, you are on, like, the edge of a cliff for some reason, right? <laughs> and the cliff starts to give out, and he pushes you away, and the cliff falls, from, like, from under him or whatever, right? And then fucking, like, if you have not gotten to A rank with him socially, he just fucking dies. Uh-huh. He dies permanently. Like, even on a casual playthrough, right? And fucking, I didn't know that when I played the game forever, like, when I was, like, in high school, right? And fucking, I remember, like, sitting there going, okay, so he's gonna come back at some point, right? <laughs> and then they got to the end of the game, and it's just like, and then all records of this person were lost to time. The same bullshit they do every single time someone dies, right? And I just, wait, wait, what? And I looked it up, and it's just, he genius. didn't, he just didn't come back. <laughs> he just died. But if you get an A rank with them, right, you, like, Go fall off the cliff with him, and then he's just fine. Oh, we're fucking gaming. Like, he's just fine. That's I guess they so did awesome. that. I, I, <laughs> and it doesn't happen on the other routes, by the way. That dude's perfectly fine on the other routes, no matter what you do. He's just chilling, unless he dies in battle, in which case it's like, yeah, anyone could fucking die in battle, I guess. being sick with it. I'm kind of sick with it. But for what purpose am I sick with it? Yo, being sick with it. It's its own reward, I guess. We're here now. Okay. I was sick with it. I was nasty with it. So what I'm trying to say is, everyone go play Fire Emblem Fates, it's my favorite game, and all Fire Emblem fans love it the best out of this whole series. Sure. All of them. It's just so fucking goofy that, like, yeah. And then, um, Fire Emblem, um, what's the word? You read a book about like, Revelations is, like, the only time you get, like, the full cast, right? So fucking goofy. Read a book about a, a jester who is sentenced to death by their king. But for their final trick, they steal the sun! Epic. The screw! Oh, wait, no, that's the wrong. That's a Mr. Beast shit. <laughs> Mr. Beast is gonna go steal the sun? Today, we are escaping execution by stealing the sun! He's British now. He's British now? You read a book about forbidden secrets of cooking. Your mind is torn asunder from the culinary secrets, driving you insane. Dude, let's go. I need to read that other book oh, now. Well, you gotta go find the other book, yeah. You read a book full of classic plays. All the world's a stage. Oh, okay. I mean, yeah, no shit. It sounds like a shitty play. <laughs> <laughs> if the whole world's a stage, where is it? Exactly. Alright. 
play exclusively Fates? Is that not what the, the game is called? Yeah, no, uh, the joke is it's Fates. <laughs> Aren't all three of them Fates? It's Fates, Birthright, Fates, Conquest, Fates, Revelations. Oh, you meant, okay, yeah, play those three and then you can skip the other games, yeah. Yeah, skip all the other ones, you don't need anything. Wait, what, whoa, whoa, whoa. You read a book about aquatic life. You'd really like to see the ocean one day. Maybe next time. That's, that's ominous. Okay. Yo, they're gonna make a sequel to Endless Ocean. Yeah, they did. <laughs> they're gonna make Endless, Endless Ocean, Ocean 3. Wait, is there, is there an Endless There's Ocean not, 3? But there should oh, be. There's fuck, a two. you gave me hope for There's a fucking a second there. I know, I played 2. 2 is wild. Yeah. You had to, like, find the secrets of an ancient civilization, and then, like, you went and fucking fought sharks in the water. Super simple sunshine. Fucking, what is it? Aw, oh, yeah, bud, you gotta go night diving into that fucking, uh, ancient ruin. Aw, oh, fuck, Thanatos, the mega giant sharks outside the window. You gotta fucking hope you don't run out of air. This is Endless Ocean 2, bud. Endless Ocean 1 was so peaceful. Yeah. I did not fucking play that one. I would have been way too scared. For a fucking, like, a they made jump. it so that animals could actually beat the shit out of you. Got to. Alright. Ah, fuck. Oh, it's moving with their chief. Hey, I can do anything now. With a, with, a, with a wall kick, I can do anything. We have fucking, like... They added, like, hostile animals in Endless Ocean 2, oh, right? Shit. Oh, shit! I can save myself! I didn't, though. So, like, sharks can just hit you or, like, bite you, right? Uh-huh. It only takes your air, right? But, like, they'll just kick the shit out of you. And it's really fucking funny. To the point where there's, like, boss fights and stuff, and it's just, like, you're just sitting there oh, like this. Insane. Because it's, like, they give you a gun air quotes it, it's like a healing gun right sure but, but it can be like dialed in a way to like they took make all predators furniture. they took all this furniture it can be dialed in a way to make predators want to like fuck off right and so oh. that's like their excuse to give you a gun it's so fucking funny i hope i'm going somewhere productive chat there seems to be no way no way to know Bro, there's like, I'm gonna be honest, like, maybe I'm just like, such a fucking, like, loser, but like, no, playing please. casual, nope, well, <laughs> playing casual and Fire Emblem, like, there's no fucking, I, I, I don't know why there's a problem with that shit. What do that you mean, problem? Yeah, th th some of the fan base gets, like, really fucking, like, pissy about it, because they're like, oh, you're playing a casual, it takes away, like, the... The strategy and the and the like what is it uh what's the word oh we've been here because casual fire. casual like removes permadeath Ow. right and so they they sometimes are like well you're playing the game where it's not intended and it's like i get that the old ones force permadeath on you but i like having the characters still alive yeah. at the end of the day and i'm bad at video games so Fire Emblem is like the most casual fucking like strategy game of all time. Yeah, some of the older ones can get kind of fucking still like zany. I don't know. Look at like Total War or some shit. I don't know. If if you go up to like a like a Total War player and say like, oh, don't play Fire Emblem on casual, they'll call you like they'll call you uh, things I can't say. Fire Emblem is casual. <laughs> is what I'm trying to say it's a Nintendo game. I don't know, man. Have you ever played Mario's Miss Gone Missing or whatever the fuck? Well, that's an exception. <laughs> See, that's the that's exception. That's the exception to the rule. Yeah. They talk about Isaac Newton and that shit. Oh my I god, think. I don't know where to go. I help no, me. I know that's Mario's time machine. I'm gonna throw up. <laughs> you have, like, a kick move. You can I know. kick balls now. But I don't stream on kick. I don't know where to go. Da -da -da no, we were da -da -da just here. Da -da Okay, go back, like, go back to the to the start of this area, and I'm sure I'll know what to do. Wait, this place. What if we get back to that area with the good music? I was there for, like, a second. Well, they're all the areas with good music, but you know what I mean. The specific area with the specific good music. Yeah. Fuck, I can get that. I can get that. 
I mean, you oh. probably could. Be right back. My roommate's dog is outside there. Oh, yo. Oh, hey, Duke. Uh, Gibson's currently uh, looking at a dog. There's currently a dog somewhere. A dog exists somewhere in the world. I know, it's I know. fucked up. Duke. Howdy. Duke, what's up? Duke, I missed your stream the other day, but like, I, I went to sleep and woke up and you were still going. Corgi. It's a, uh, my roommate has a Corgi. Um, yeah. Hello, congrats. By the way, congrats on Canadian citizenship. Oh Fuck shit. Yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah, Duke, Duke is Duke out there now. That shit. That shit's hard. I've heard that shit's harder than American citizenship, citizenship, so... I mean, considering, like, the amount of bumps I saw along the way, like, yeah. Please get me there! Oh my god! I got the key! Cool. Yeah. Jesus fucking yeah. Christ. Yeah, takes a long fucking time. They, uh... They don't want people coming to that country very much. I feel like that's just a lot of countries. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that's kind of... It's it's tough getting citizenship anywhere, but... Damn. Yeah. Damn, that seems rough. But yeah, hi. I'm playing Pseudo Regalia. This game's cool. I, I know I'm yeah. lost as fuck. Okay. Gained the new outfit! Okay, Yo. fuck putting pants on. I got a new fucking outfit. Pants. You want pants on this character. Oh, I... I didn't even realize I got like two outfits. That's cool. Yeah. You got the Greaves and then you got Professional. Dude, dude. Oh, oh. Those are pants. I. Just, just the basic vest, I think. No. Just the Sun Greaves. I. Okay. The leg slits are fucking cool. No, it's really. It's like too cool. It's like really cool. Is that what, all that was in here? It's like really cool. I mean, it was worth it. It was def. It was definitely worth it. Look, that's what I'll the say. Fucking, what is it? So, what does the accessibility option do for turning on pants if you have pants already on? I don't know, but I might. But... Need to, I might need to turn it on. I mean, are you? No, not yet. Oh. <laughs> Get away to But I'm trying to be one. good. I'm trying to be good. 
No, oh shit, help me! Do you want to know? Do I want to know what? What oh, pants, pants do? Thing? Oh, what the pants do? No. Fuck the pants. No. So Gibson, Gibson has stated that they won't put on, like, pants on this character, right? Unless they're given 30 bucks so that they can pick up a bomb rush cyber yeah. or cyberpunk. Come on now. <laughs> okay, furry. <laughs> no. Uh, it, okay. If the outfits get any cuter, I'm putting on the pants. I'm just saying. Some people may find it distracting. We have a dress code the, here. The existence of pants? No, the lack of them. <laughs> Yeah, no, you hit it fucking hard with the no, <laughs> shouting what you... out pro Jared. How you can, what? Who could be worse? What are you gonna oh, wait, shout no, out? These are, not, these are not the pants, by the way. This is just like an alternate outfit. Oh yeah, no. Fucking what is it? Can I be honest? Is... Can I be? Can I be honest for a second? What's no, that? no. Okay. Never mind. Okay. You got got rid of the pants. Ah! I mean, that's what happens. No. You get rid of the pants. Come on, come on. Okay. Just strangely enough, the design is more distracting with the pants. That's how I'll put it. Okay. Help. I mean, I guess it's just probably the fact that you're used to the design without pants. I might have to get my roommate's dog in. I don't, I don't know what he wants. He probably wants to be in here, but... What do I do here? Um... Stream dog? No. It's not my dog. I know I just told Matter to stream a dog that's not his, but... Oh, okay. Yeah. Have just I gone too as far? if you didn't say that like an hour ago. That's just. I, I don't know if an hour is a just amount of time. Am I like fucked here? What the fuck? Maybe Wait, no. you need to. No, no, no. Okay, I'm gonna see what the dog needs. Can't believe it. Dogs are real. So how's it going, chat? You enjoyed the dog stream? The dog in it? Bro, did you fucking know, right? Did you know that there's like fucking... Like pizza? That's like cheese and pretzel, and that's it. it. It's just like a pretzel pizza, but they have like cheese sauce instead of like pizza sauce, right? So it's just a big fucking pretzel. Isn't that fucked up? Like, it's it's actually surprisingly good. I ordered it the other fucking day because I'm a stupid like maniac, right? But like, <laughs> it's like, wh where did these ideas come from? But it's like, it, it's like literally, it's like that cheese dip that they give you at like a pretzel place, right? On a pizza as the sauce. And then like the crust is pretzel, right? But then like the pizza cheese is like your standard pizza cheese, you know? It's wild. Okay. Wait, hey, what we're are you talking about, about cheese? Pretzel pizza. Oh. What is pretzel pizza? I've never had that. Uh, Wait, the crust what the is pretzel. What the fuck? Is that a reflection? Or... What? There's a whole mm. world under there. Whole new world. I have not solved the mystery of what the dog wants, so he might start barking again. What's the dog doing? I um, don't know. So, it, what I was describing was basically like the crust is pretzel, right? And it's got salt on it, you know? <sighs> we almost got that, yeah? And then, um, instead of like tomato sauce, right? It's cheese, like that, like the dip cheese that they give you at like the fucking at like a pretzel place in like a mall, right? Like oh. the cheese dip. Wait, yeah. And then, and then there's cheese on top of that, which is like the normal pizza cheese, and that's the pizza. Please. Ugh. 
Damn. I'd try that if I could eat cheese. There's also like a version of it that has fucking pepperoni on Come it. Come on! I don't know about the pepperoni on Get me on out of here, whatever. As much. I, I guess it would. I don't know. I eat that, I eat that with pepperoni. I mean, it's just I, like I pretzel ordered... crust on like a pizza, right? It's pretzel crust and then the cheese sauce. Mmm. Che cheese sauce on a pizza that's already cheese? Yeah. Fuck that. That's not. That's rancid. Don't eat, you don't eat that. There was also an option that was just like, here's a normal fucking pizza, but it has a pretzel crust. Have you ever it's had just... the Dairy Queen pretzel things? What the fuck is that? Is that like a, a, a thing, a, the pretzel that you dip in the thing? Like, oh, yeah. No, no, no. Like... I'm going to switch oh, to Orbo's I... Odyssey soon, but I want to... I, I, always fucking, I always forget that Dairy Queen has like a different menu depending on if you're in Texas or not. What? Of course it would. Yeah. No, like literally Dairy Queen outside of Texas oh. has a completely different menu from Texas Dairy Queen. What? Like, it's stupid. <laughs> no, I'm for it. It, it. It's like... Here, hold on. Let me, let me pull up both menus. We're, we're doing a thing now. Y'all deserve your own menu. Do we? Nope. Yeah. Y'all deserve a worse menu. A no offense, Mato. Uh, none taken. Trust me, I live here. I know how fucking bad this place is. Y'all deserve slot menu until your people wise enough. So we deserve slot menu forever. See, I'm not one of those people that's like, we should annex Texas, so fuck all those people, but you should be eating slop until you bring abortion back. But I'm already eating slop even before <laughs> you should be forced to. was banned. But I barely have like 20 bucks to my name on a good day. It's like I'm well, eating slop to begin with. Good thing it's government mandated slop. It is free. Oh god. In I my hypothetical. Was, I wish it was fucking free food. Well, I'd take garbage free food. Well, okay. I don't want to see this place anymore. So, what is it? Did we go back into that other place? No, we. now that we have our wall jump, we can do other shit in the other place. I hope. I love just looking at both menus. You want to know what's the first thing I see that's different? Huh? The burgers are called, um, what is it? Whoa. The normal Dairy Queen burgers are variations of busters, right? So you what? have Hunger Buster and Belt Buster, right? Dude, Hunger Buster? Don't forget Belt Buster. Belt Buster? Belt. Belt. Oh my god. Ew. Yeah. Uh, I, th that's not appetizing, guys. There's also Triple Buster. <laughs> triple fucking. That's like. <laughs> new Delta Rune music just leaked. <laughs> triple Buster. So that's a. Uh, oh wait, no, that's Texas. Okay. Texas is the Busters. It's a, it's a state about bust. <laughs> busters. Okay, we're back fucking here. <laughs> But now I have my wall jump, so I can I do almost shit here. said something so much worse. Holy shit. Um... <laughs> Wait, what? What did you just say? I I, almost, I said it's it's the state where there's like, uh, it's the state all about busters, right? I almost said it's the state all about busting. <laughs> it's a busting state, honestly. <laughs> God, no. Um, in normal Dairy Queen, it, they're called stack burgers, right? Yeah. So it's like you got your backyard bacon ranch signature stack of burger. And your original uh, stack burger or whatever the fuck, right? Oh my Texas god. Texas also has Texas tea brand tacos, which are like the most depressing see... tacos I've ever seen. Texas tea brand tacos. I oh my fucking god. Chat, someone back someone backseat me. Backseat me, you're getting banned. Dave and uh, Buster's? Wait. Where where was Dave and Buster started? I Maybe go to Bailey? Up. Oh, yeah. Uh, mm, let's see if I remember how to get there. Uh, Dave and Buster's oh, was so opened in Dallas. They took all his furniture. So, I guess Texas really is the busting state. That's what I'm saying. Oh, fuck this place. Bailey, okay, Bailey, Bailey. 
That's my friend. That's Bailey. Um. Oh my God, where's Bailey? Also, Texas Dairy Queen has the uh, steak. I'm fingers. close. Okay, thank you. Jesus Compared Christ. To normal Dairy Queen, which has pretzel sticks. And whatever the, the most depressing looking chili dog I've ever seen. Hold up. I'm sorry. I need to send you this. Is steak fingers just steak fries? No, the, it's like breaded steak. That's horrible. What? Have no. You never had no, a chicken no, fried no. steak? No. It's like a whole thing down here. I can never go to Texas. That sounds gross as hell. It's not bad. It's just like a fucking steak. Like, what is it? Like a flattened steak patty that's like breaded. Or not steak. It's like beef more than anything, but still. Okay. I would hope it's not steak. It, it's just called chicken fried steak, but it's like... It's more like a beef patty here. that's like flattened a fuck ton and then deep fried and then served with like cream gravy sometimes. Uh, uh, was it here? No. Wait, was it here? This is a this is an area uh, transmission door. This is liminal door. Oh my god! Thank you. So do you want to see the most depressing chili dog that you've ever seen? Yeah. And then don't forget the normal one. You can post I, I it in chat. In, I, I put them in VC text because they're just images. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to link it to the link link Dairy chat, Queen link website. Chat. Fine, I'll, I'm, I'll wait, gonna, uh, I'm too lazy to put it on the stream right now. Fine. Here you go, chat. The two for five chili dog. <laughs> <laughs> Dairyqueen.com. <laughs> Let's go. There you go. You wanted me to put that on the stream? It's a chili yeah. dog. It it's doesn't even look, it doesn't even chili look dog. that bad. It does not look that bad. It looks like a normal chili dog. It's just because it's on its side, dude. What? It's just because it's on its side that it doesn't look depressing? Then, then it does look depressing. It doesn't okay, even look the... that bad. It looks like a chili okay, dog. Okay, Gibson, I, yeah. I have a fucking... I have a question. I'm going to post a link. I'm I want the... I want you... I'm putting the. Want... I'm putting this outfit back on seven. Dude. <laughs> All right. Um... I wanted you to look at the name of this food product and tell me what you think it is. Dude! This... Dude. Okay. Fine. What? Look at Leighton chat. That's... What, what do you think that is? Disgusting. What do you mean, what do I think that is? It says what it is. Oh, what, what Jolito? It, it's like breaded pepper. Yeah. I mean, I'm not gonna call it gross, but I wouldn't eat it. I mean, the image isn't doing it any wonders, man. No! Or any favors. I mean, it's like, I would eat it, probably. It's just that the image that they put there and oh. the name they gave it kind of both are not really appealing. Stop. You can't say that, Austin. Okay, did we need to climb in this house at all, or was this just like... Something that, okay, okay. All right, we've checked here. Now we can actually explore this area. That's a long ass fucking bridge. The fucking cre- Ask maybe, ask force me to try this, this dish, this meal. Wasn't very tasty, honestly. And I think Ask agrees. I forgot that they just have like a fucking country singer as like the brand ambassador in Texas for Dairy Queen. Who? Uh, fucking, I don't know, who the fuck, whoever the fuck Josh Abbott is. Uh oh. Is, is he related to the other Abbott that is out there? I have no fucking clue. I do not. I can look it up. <laughs> Whatever. He's, he's from Texas, so. It's probably evil. Yeah. Probably evil. I mean, he's a country singer. Of course he's evil. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It did need a little something. It was Nepal, so it was just like Cactus, but it was just like Cactus. That's a big guy. I'm going to walk away from him now. Wait. Oh, shit. Secret man. I'm not here. You are. I gotta figure out what this dog wants, but I don't know what this dog wants. Here, 
I'm gonna check my roulette. Right God, it's like, what is it? It's just really fucking funny how like, I I'm just sitting here and I'm just thinking about shit and it's just like, oh yeah, that is just like a Texas thing only. And then I'm like, that that's the entire fucking state for some fucking reason. We just have like five, six different things down here that no other state has. He doesn't want to hang out with me, trust me. What the hell? You, you don't know this dog. Dog, the dog just does not. <laughs> he's a chill dog. dog. Does not want to chill. And apparently, he's been let out and fed and watered. Hey Gibson. Yeah. What do you think about dilly bars? I, I think I think I've had that before. What's a dilly bar? It, it's just like a, it's like soft serve on a on a stick in chocolate. It, it just has a stupid name. <laughs> Maybe I haven't. Yeah, that just sounds like ice cream. It is ice cream. Well, then, sure, it's I just, got it. It's a dilly bar, though. Uh, this is a scary bar. It's a dilly bar. What, what makes it a dilly bar? It's a dilly bar. Okay, is it is it a brand? Is it a dish? It's got a, it's got a cow lick on it. What the fuck does that mean? It's got a little cow lick on it. No, it doesn't. There's hair? <laughs> Are you saying I'm lying to you? It's got a little cow lick on it, dude. In what way? It's got a little cow lick on it. Okay. How do you lick a cow? Very easily. <laughs> you, maybe for you. Uh, oh, oh, Are you oh. telling me you can't just walk out there and lick a cow right now? Sorry, I don't live in Texas, buddy. I don't live on the damn farm. Ah, uh, damn. I guess that's another Texas uh, exclusive. <laughs> if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, you know? What are we talking about? <laughs> Texas. 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 And... Oh, what's that up there? That's a big key! Uh oh I mean, you should always tip the cows. Like, I mean, come on. You know, at least 15%, but like 20%, you know, at least. That was Ow! such a stupid fucking joke, dude. <laughs> Oh, ow! My sword! Can I heal without that? Nope. Texic. Full four. Okay, you have to die. Cool. Ooh. Oh! I forgot about the fucking sword. Dude, yeah, now I want some soft serve, and I can't eat that. You're evil as fuck. No, just get the non-dairy dilly bar. Where are those? A Dairy Queen. <laughs> no. I don't want to go to Dairy Queen. I doubt they have those in the West Coast, even. No, the, like, literally, Dilly Bar is, like, one of the few things they all share. Oh, shit. Blizzards, Dilly Bars, and the way they do, like, their soft serve to ha give it a cow lick are, like, signature Dairy Queen things. Is that just a major thing I just got? Probably. It's, it's like one of five keys to open the great door, so I guess so. Badass. What the? Oh, I have to get that. How do I get there? I basically had a dilly bar. It sounds like it's just ice cream, so yeah, you've probably had a dilly bar before. The blue I mean, bell ones? Okay. Yeah, no, blue bell's like a whole thing here. Yeah, isn't that the ice cream that, like, did they for get some reason, down for, like, killing people? D no, but there was a whole thing a few years back where, like, somebody just kept licking, like, the uh, Blue Bell ice cream, like, gallons, right? Because, no, I think they um, killed people. I'm going to be shocked. They're still around. They're still, like, a huge thing here. I like, saw so Chipotle. Yeah. I think they had Salmonella one time and had a recall. Oh. Okay. Okay, well, you can't yeah. die from salmonella, so I guess not. Yeah, there was, like, a lady who was, like, licking uh, Bluebell, like, half gallons, right? Because they don't have, like, um, like a protective cover on them for some reason, right? Yeah, I'm sure this and... woman's been arrested and probably put to death, too. Solar <laughs> wind, jump while sliding. Oh, okay. Oh, Dude, yeah. that's so sick. 
This is cool. Alright. Okay, I fucked up immediately. It was no, it literally was for the vine. So what can what can you do? Like legally, what is the defense there if it's for the vine? I think you just have to let him go. It was like uh, what's no, the word? Please. It's just like the fact that like what is it? It was like this lady was just doing it and then putting it on like I think it was TikTok or Vine or something, right? I think it might have been Vine. It was a while ago, right? And um, what is it? And she's just like she just would go up into like a store, right? Like an H E B or like a Kroger or something. Um, and then like just take the lid off of a bluebell half like gal, right? And just fucking take a huge lick out of it. And then put it back on the shelf. She really did that, though. She really did that. Yeah, she did. She got arrested for it. It's kind of shit that, like, yeah, yeah, of course it, of course she got arrested for it. Yeah, because, like, like th there's a whole reason why, like, at the very least, medicine has that, like, tamper seal shit on it. Because, the like, Tylenol literally. The Tylenol poisoning. Yeah, the Tylenol poisoning. Like, so, like, a lot of food does that, too. Dude. Fuck. No? I mean, yeah, people be poisoning shit for fun. Like, people be licking shit for fun. I think it was early TikTok, because Vine, like, you, you can't fit such a dramatic act into six seconds. Oh, fuck yeah. Meal? It was totally Vine? How do you remember? <laughs> What, what year was it? If it was, if it was Vine? No, because I think Vine Vine wasn't around like that long in the grand scheme of things, right? Uh, it was 2019. So that's not Vine as fuck, yeah. Uh, let's see. Upload it to Twitter. Upload. There it, shut it down. Shut that one down next. No. Yeah. Damn. I'm on the roofs now? Man, it's almost like if you tweet about you committing a crime, you'll get arrested for it. No, 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 no. no. Yeah, the ice cream looking lady, yeah. Hey, Hook. Hi, Hook. Please? No, it was 2019, which is really fucking funny because that was like a year before the pandemic. We have fucking patient zero, I guess. Oh, Jesus Christ, yeah, Oof. Hey, you want to see, hear about another fun Dairy Queen item because I, I'm still on the yeah. website for yeah. some reason? What about a buster bar? She bust my bar? She bust her my bar until no. I treat. No, no. Because it literally called the buster bar treat. <laughs> the treat? Dude, I want a treat. Here, I'll, I'll link it. It, has it. it doesn't say it in the link, but it says it on the fucking... Yeah. I have to make I don't this. know. <laughs> yes, I have to make the buster bar? No, like... no, I have to make this jump. I oh, the fuck I was the buster like... bar. What the fuck? The They're ribbed. <laughs> They're ribbed. Oh, no. <laughs> Hold on now. That... Are you, are you... Is that how that's supposed to look? Yeah. Are... Is that how that's supposed to look? Oh, no, they're yeah. like, showing you the interior. I thought they just like... Pulled one no. out of the fucking freezer and was like, yeah, no, that's what it, it looks like. Out of the freezer and it's got like a fucking chunk taken out of it. Oh, I'm gonna make it's it like easier. It's like or whatever. What? What do you? What the, what the fuck did you just say? Skablounched. <laughs> what do you mean? Wait, you don't know skablounched? You're making shit up now. Shaking my head. I can't believe you don't know famous chocolate bar skablounched. Okay, fine. I'm putting my browser on the screen, so you don't have to click on these links, chat. It's just. Yeah. Look at this. I mean, actually, this looks, it just looks like good. And this just looks like good. Why are you showing me this? Just looks like, are you doing this to torture me? This just looks like yes. a good ice cream bar. What the fuck is wrong with you? It's a fucking, it's a buster bar tree. And? And what about it? It's a buster bar. <laughs> I guess so. I guess so. But like, I, 
Oh, I've been here. I didn't have to go. But look, come on now. It's just ice cream. Dairy Queen needs to stop naming shit. It's just it's ice cream. Just call it just ice cream. No, ice cream see they they gotta call it the Buster Bar, or else you won't know how much it can bust through your belt. Yeah. The... <laughs> oh God, we should shut up. Jesus. I'm not saying anything. Why are there oh, so they many also graves? Got... There's so many graves. They also... here. Don't forget the peanut Buster Parfait. No, <laughs> I think I would. I think I would forget that. <laughs> What, you don't want the peanut ooh, buster? Ooh. New area. Oh! Ooh. Dude. All right. This, all this shit's going in the stream playlist, by the way. Oh yeah, 100%. Dude, okay. Yeah, this area is already fucking cool. I'm, being, I'm getting awesome. And I've lost everything. Just give me a damn double jump. What the hell was that about? Just zoomed on past the damn pole. Okay. Okay, what am I actually doing here? Oh! Oh, there's... She slides. She slides. There's friction here. Okay. So if you don't use... The bubble boost... I feel like the game is really starting now. Like, the platforming is actually becoming... Substantial. I have my moves. I... Okay. My only complaint about this game so far is that getting the wall bounce move makes it kind of hard to grab on ledges. Should I go up? Or... That's quite literally my only complaint, though. Um, and where's my map, Metroidvania doves? Ooh, I gotta go up there. That could be an outfit. There's no way I'm getting that right now. Unless... Oh, unless... There's a workaround, but I can hold on it? Like, is the workaround something I should figure out on my own? Because if so, thank you. I can... I'll try to figure it out. Thank you for not just saying it. See? See? When I say you can backseat a little bit, this is what I mean, chat. Oh, oh, back here. Now I know there's a workaround, though, so I'm gonna try to find it. Yeah, this game is so short that I just prefer not to be told anything unless I'm lost, which I often am. So, uh, I'm pulling up a map now. <laughs> yeah? Yeah. Ooh, this is fucking hard. Whoa, how am I supposed to do this? You pulled up a map of what? I was, I was making I was making a joke off of how you said, "Oh, I, like I won't be back suited until I get lost." And I'm like, "All right, cool. I'm pulling up a map right now." Oh, well, actually, thank you. That might help. And I'm not actually pulling up a map. Well, why not? Dude, it's fine. I'll pull up a map of the. What the fuck? How am I supposed to? Hmm. This is definitely some bonus challenge shit that I don't have to do, I hope. But I kind of want to do it. <clears throat> There's no way I can do this with, like, just the shit I have now, right? No, no, there's no way. Okay, what, what would I do? Hypothetically, what would I do? Slide jump into this, that, 
That. Ooh, and then that. Oh, wait, you can't really. You can't wall jump with the bubble boost. Yeah, it's impossible. I think that's impossible. Okay. This area is for later. But I do want that thing over there. That green orb. Ah! Okay, I need to remember I can cancel out of the ground stomp with a jump. That is very kind of them. Alright. Believe in me. I could do that as fuck. No, don't land on that, please. Take me back up. Okay. A little more precision. And I think we got it. Alright, bud. I yeah. pulled up the map. I looked at the map. I don't think I can help you with this map. What do you mean? Uh, it, I'm just really bad at reading maps. I'm not getting that. Well, that's fair. Yeah, me too. Also, like, the first three results for it were all, like, copy-paste of the same article that were just basically, like, I think bots stealing shit from Reddit again. Of fucking course, yeah. That's the way of Google nowadays. Yeah. I remember fucking looking up no, something, cancel. um, related to fucking Dredge. Remember when Dredge came out, right? Yeah. Fucking, I was looking up stuff related to Dredge when that came out, right? And fucking, one of the things I was looking up was how to get more upgrade materials, because I was like, well, fuck it, I'll do the, alive. you know, I'll try to get, like, a fully upgraded ship or whatever, right? And then fucking, um, one of the things, one of the articles that popped up, I, I now thinking back on it, must have been, like, an AI thing, right? Because, like, literally, um, I saw, like, a quote in the article that was just like, Another way of getting upgrade parts in Dredge is to play the PvP mode, and I'm just sitting there like, what the fuck do you mean <laughs> the so PvP right. mode? <laughs> players, so who, right. Wait, what? players who win a lot in the PvP mode can get uh, a ton of upgrade parts real hey. quick, and I'm just sitting here like, huh? am I playing the same I'm game? Here. Why am I back here? Metroidvania, bud. Was there anything else in that area, though? I don't know, probably. Chat, if, if you if you would be so obliged, is there anything else I should do in that area before I continue on? Not right now? Okay, I thought so. Uh, it's all the way back at the start, too. Okay. Yeah, we went here and... Wait, why couldn't we do the thing here? Was it because, like... We didn't have the slide jump? Or... Let's, let's try it. Uh oh. Ooh. Oh, it's. Oh, I know. Okay, I was surprised that there was a whole nother like level down here. It's just because we're going up. And uh, that makes a little more sense. Oh, this, this is something. This isn't a fuck you come back later area now. Oh. Okay. Oh, we're on the other side of this bridge now. It's beautiful. It's like Dark Souls. Yo, is it, real what, Dark Souls? What are these things? Are they like platforms or what? Could you like do a move that bounces you off of it? I don't think so. Maybe it's something for later. Maybe it's something for later. Maybe it's a Metroidvania. Maybe, just maybe. It's a Metroidvania. Hmm, couldn't be true. I don't know why, 
Uh, I have the bluebell side up because we were talking about it earlier, and I I think I was trying to find something funny, right? I forgot about the fucking like packaging they have for like their like ice cream bars, right? And they just yeah. have like people's faces on them. What? Like, hold on. I'll, I'll, I'll link. I'll, I'll link like pictures so that. Yeah. It's fucking. There's just. <laughs> Of course, of course, we of course we got like this dude right here. This is back to the theater. Oh, did we come in through like the exit of the theater? Or something? Yeah, I linked the the picture of the moo bars and the fucking the moo fudge bars. bars with the fucking coach on it. I think I have that coach as an emote in a fucking like Discord server for like testing shit. Okay, question: Can I give Sybil a hat? That, uh, that should be an accessibility option. Maybe. Nope, no fucking way. No fucking way. Yeah. Okay. Oh, well, I really wish I had fucking Nitro, dude, so I could just post that fucking coach everywhere. See, I want to switch to Orbo's Odyssey now, but if I stop now... I'm not gonna remember where to go. Mm-hmm. I, I need to find like an area that I can start at and just walk forward and start making progress next time I stream this. So I, I'll definitely be finishing this on stream soon. But but for but let's not get ahead of ourselves. Where the fuck am I going? Why is there two in the top left? That, that's your bar. Too. Okay. Uh, okay. Remember, like, at the beginning of the game where you got, like, a power-up that was, like, if you have, like, two, one, you have, like, longer reach, two, whatever Certainly. the fuck, right? Yeah, surely there's something in here. Oh, that's, like, yeah, okay. That's your, like, Hollow Knight healing bar. Oh, that's what they meant by that. I never and asked. And then that's, like, I just assumed that you knew, because, hey, they took away all his furniture. They took away all his furniture. And that's so fucking sad. That's so sad. But you also know it's fucked up and sad. Yeah. Uh, check VC text. Okay. Is it more Dairy Queen? Look at that guy. That dude is awesome. Okay, I've seen that emote before. Yeah, I think I've posted it somewhere before, because I made that myself. What a beautiful man. You know what? You know what would be fucked up? I've been here. And I'm doing it right now as we speak. Huh. You know what would be fucked up? Huh. If I made it an emote in here... I don't think you can do that. I think we're out of slots. Are, Are we? we? Aren't we? We have 43 slots available in here. I don't here. think we... Who boosted the server while I wasn't looking? Bud, we have like fucking six emotes in here. Yeah, but like... You don't get that many on a free server. You gotta boost. We, we have eight emotes if you include the, the one animated emote we have. Well, okay. We also have 50? no boosts oh, in here. You got one, I'm boosting. I mean, yeah, but like, ah! there's no level. Okay. You need two for a level. I might have to look at the map for this game later, but like, I want a progressive map. I don't want, I don't want to get spoiled. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, okay. Ah, don't slide. God damn it, it's a web P. No. Hold on, I can fix this. Die fucked up. And I'm sorry. I'm gonna close the art I made earlier and instead open up the, the fucking <laughs> coach from Bluebell. It happened again. <gasps> Never mind. Alright. Uh, if, <laughs> if people ask where this emote comes from, Gibson, uh, I mean, hey, just say whatever. I'll say it came from I made it myself all by myself. <laughs> it's gonna, it says hey. uploaded by me. <laughs> they won't know if they're not in the server. Wait, Gibson, hold on. Is your fucking Discord? <laughs> Is my Discord what? Is my Discord what? <laughs> Should I say it out loud? Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> is your Discord Super Smash Bros. Brawl? Yeah, the fuck it is. <laughs> uh huh. 
I fucking, like, Ooh, I didn't attack. blink because I just fucking saw fucking, what's the word? I, I just saw like, oh, uploaded by fucking, what is it? Uploaded by Bailey, uploaded by, uh, who else is in there? Uh, uploaded by Yokao, right? And it's just uploading like, a wall of uploaded by Super Smash Bros. Brawl. Listen, if you, if, you would do the same if you could, but unfortunately I took it first. I, d no. Okay. <laughs> we got a strong power. You can break walls now? It's all right. I'm gonna, we're gonna switch to Orbo's Odyssey real quick. Not gonna do a BRB or anything. Uh, Yo, Orbo it up. Like maybe I should, just so I can ping people again. Uh, sorry, I need to stretch. Actually, my back fucking hurts. Now that I'm sitting here in my gamer chair and not playing a game, it's the the gamer pain is starting to set in. So, I'll be back in one minute, and then uh, we'll play Orbo's Odyssey, which is apparently. A game, or it's Peeb. It, I didn't even know it was Peeb. It's or related, related to, Peeb. to Peeb. It's like Peeb's cousin or brother. It, it's the same characters from Peeb. It's Peeb, the PB Cinematic Universe. D don't call it the PB Cinematic Why? Universe. Because it's like that sounds like the PB Cinematic Universe. Yeah, but that's not a thing. PB's not even a show, so. I mean, not yet. Not ever. I think it got canceled. I wouldn't be shocked, honestly. <laughs> You know what? I'm getting to the bottom of this right now. I'm doing what every smart person does on Google, and I'm just... Go <laughs> Why is Pibby Glitch this? <laughs> Why does Pibby Glitch? Why, is Why it does the Pibby fucking... Glitch? Why is it the first result? <laughs> well... Oh, hold on. Hold I need on. I have a to minute. remember these words real quick. I have to remember what, exactly what this man says. They took away all my furniture. Uh, let's see. Alright. Matto, you have the floor. Feel free to talk about whatever you want. I'll be back in five minutes. Alright, sick. I'm gonna fucking, uh, fuck up horribly with the dead air, and it's gonna be really awkward. Bro, fucking... <laughs> I still can't get over the pivy glitch. It's like, literally the second fucking... I don't have a dog to put on the mic. I think my neighbor dog just... My neighbor's dog went to sleep at some point because it's like 11. Holy shit, it's 11? Oh god. When did it become 11 o'clock? My other one is like 30 minutes away. Or wait, yeah. Put the Dairy Queen on the mic? I'm not going to Dairy Queen at 11 o'clock. I think most Dairy Queens close at 10. Yeah, they close at a... what's the word? They close at 10. Did you know they only open a... they open from 10 to 10, except for on Sundays, where it's 11 to 10 for some reason? Because it's God's Day. <laughs> okay, is it just me or is Dairy Queen like the high bomber? <laughs> yo, Gives yo, bomber. <laughs> Thank you for the raid. How's it going? How's Pikmin? Elmification? Don't... Both, both raid messages from from the raid today have been about Elmo or puppets. I mean, yeah. What are you colluding? What are you doing to me? Uh, the, Thank you for they're that. getting together. They're getting together to shove you into a pity glitch, and you're gonna become a puppet. Uh, we just got finished. Well, not finished. Finished. I'm probably gonna, hopefully, finish that next stream. Uh, we just finished playing Suda Regalia for the day, and now we're switching to a little game called Orbo's Odyssey, a game which I didn't know had some clout. I didn't. I didn't know Orbo's. Orbo's. Uh, I didn't know Orbo's Odyssey was part of a, a cinematic universe. Pikmin 4 was awesome. You quote unquote beat the game. What the fuck? You quote unquote beat Pikmin 4. Why do you oh, have to put quotes like, around that? It's Pikmin. Is it, the, the, uh, is it like a scary. Pikmin 2's kind of thing where it's like the game goes, oh, here's your end credits. Oh, by the way, here's like the other fucking like chunk of the game. Have fun. Huh. I still need to play Pikmin 1 and 2 and 3 and 4. Uh, I will say Pikmin 2 is brutal as fuck. So I've and heard. also terrifying. 
It's like a literal, like, enemy in the game that jump scares you, basically. Like, it doesn't, like, jump scare you in, in, like, the traditional sense. It just fucking comes out of nowhere and fucks you up so bad that it's terrifying. Anyway, Pikmin 2 is my favorite in this <laughs> series. I haven't played 4 yet, but... I've heard nothing but good things about 4, though. Like... What is it? I hear it's a lot more like 2 and a lot of the very good ways, but it also still has like a bunch of funky shit from like 1 and 3 and it's... yeah. Like... Okay. Yeah, there's been a fucking ton of games out this year, man. And maybe it's just me, or it feels like there's like way more games this year that are just like fucking going nuts, dude. You know? It's about to get even worse in like a month. Everything's fucking coming out this month. Oh, yeah. Fuck. I had like a list of games in my head that isn't there anymore, but like, what the f Oh. Yeah. I mean, hey, if like, what is it? If people are saying that 4 is better than 2, then like, fucking hell yeah, dude. Because <laughs> like, for the longest time, 2 was like the best one.